going down in here. <laughs> ooch, 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 ooch. <laughs> I think you'll find yourself in the no wives. Club. Absolutely. If not, you will find a bitch. <laughs> yeah. You definitely gonna you invited learn. her there. That's how you're talking. <laughs> she is now already. Yeah, wife in the next row. Don't worry about that. We don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> Turn on the red and blue lights, bitch. <laughs> the No Wives Club. You want some free shit? Call 256 788 7339. Quit ogling me, bitch. That's what I get for watching Scarface. It's a cockroach. Ooh, this shit tastes like tires. Hey, look. This is for entertainment purposes only. Explicit motherfucking content. Parental guidance is strongly suggested. Pay attention to what your kids doing on the internet. Subscribe, like, share, smoke for me to podcast. Let's get into the show. Oh man, rocking Rizzo. Y'all ready? Ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Well, shit, let's do it then, let's ladies and it. gentlemen. Before. If you've been before, welcome back. Smoke if you ain't never been and you about to experience some shit Join you us. ain't never experienced before, cause you ain't never been here to experience this shit before. But um But now you here. Kick your feet up, Bow. roll your blunt, drink your something, um, prepare. Drink me some. For the greatest show on earth, and I ain't talking about the circus, baby. This is the smoke for me the podcast. You know what I'm oh, talking son, about? We is this. the smokers and Man. we is up in here one more time. For one more episode, yeah. one more again. 256-788-7339. Ask the smokers at gmail.com. Like, comment, Blind subscribe, comment. share, notification bell. All the things that people tell you to do with your own time, do them now. Um, yeah, hit us up though. Goddamn, call the phone, email a nigga. To, uh, tell me what you want me to talk about. We'll see if we can touch on those topics for you. This is Smoke Permitted Podcast. I think we're on episode 120. 120. Y'all will know by whatever you read before you clicked or whatever we put in the title before we shared. So you don't got to worry about that like we do. And right now, we here. We in this bitch to my right. Hold on. Hey, look. We got some free shit. Oh, we um, do. We ain't going to tell y'all what it is yet because it's just some free shit. It it's going to be some more free shit and all this shit. It's worth some money, oh. though. It's just going to be free for you. Call, call our phone and tell us, like, I want some of that free shit. And yeah. you might get some free shit. 788, wait a minute, call 256 788 7339. You want some free shit? Call 256 788 7339. I'm just saying. The singer to my right is the Honorable Reverend Cato Jackson. I don't do this for a living, I just do this to live. No, I'm talking about. I'm the one and only, the only one, Bob Jacquez. And we're glad to have our third party, third person, Welcome third back. mind in the Welcome building. Back. Off Welcome white Mike is back, back. bitches. Uh, yes, and you can't do shit about it. Yes, <laughs> Why would they want to do? They shouldn't even want to do shit. It don't matter. You can't. If you want to do some shit about it, you're a about motherfucking it. hater. Shit. <laughs> See me in a duck race. Nah. <laughs> That ain't what you want. Hey, we got to have one that song, ain't what man. You want. Bro, I be riding by so much water and streams <laughs> on my routes. I be like, bro, that could, we could, we could, where could I park at if we did it right no. there? No. <laughs> it's so, but they, they far away. I got it the It ain't ducks. worth the drive for the duck I race. I got the duck. I was yeah. always worth the drive. Grand Canyon. 45 here minutes, we an hour along. Oh, Grand shit. Canyon, here we, we going to Colorado River. <laughs> duck I guess race. so. The you whole right. fucking river. You right. Mississippi, uh, too. We gonna start in Minnesota, end in Louisiana. <laughs> the series called Whitewater Ducks. <laughs> we gonna <laughs> series called Where the Fuck My Duck At? <laughs> shit, what's been popping, man? Man, I ain't shit, man. Um, shit, the job. So, my job. I told you it's a bunch of young motherfuckers, right? Like a bunch of young motherfuckers. I'm the, I'm the oldest by far, and they keep letting me know I'm old and and shit that they do. Like, <laughs> so we in the meeting and shit. <coughs> And they talking about like, yeah, yeah, you know how the old people still got cable. And everybody, I'm looking around and they laughing and see like cable TV. And I'm like, excuse me, um, I got cable TV. Fuck y'all talking about. Then everybody speak like, oh, we forgot you old. You old nigga. So we, I'm riding with one of them and shit. We we listen to music and shit. Motherfucker outcast song came. I was like, oh yeah, see this type. Oh, I forgot you like the old people music. <laughs> but you said it like an old person. No. That's the shit I'm talking about, though. Yeah. 
I've been I've been listening to fucking Future and Twenty One Savage for four goddamn hours. So when some outcasts come on, that's that shit you I'm say, talking hey, about. Hey, nah. I, I didn't I didn't do that. I didn't say hey, nah. I didn't say hey, nah. <laughs> I didn't throw both of my now, hands. young. Oh, turn that up. Don't I'm switch that. I'm just saying. I've been waiting <laughs> on this type of shit. So, yeah. I forgot you like old people music. Man. Like, bitch, this is outcast. Hell he was like, too. I was just a little baby when this came out. <laughs> and then I thought about when it came out. Like, yeah. You was. Yeah. This is old people yeah. music, ain't it? I don't give a fuck. It's an eight ball of MJG on that playlist. That shit jamming. Man, <laughs> Give a whole fuck. Yeah, old people shit. All this shit. <laughs> I was looking for new balances online yesterday. Bitch! Tell them what it's about. Pow! Pow! You had the right whiff. No. <laughs> yeah, you ain't done. My don't. toes in the front got to breathe now. <laughs> you ain't I ain't done. with all this scratching up shit. You ain't done with the polo, is you? Hell no. Hell uh, no. New balance <laughs> to polo. Comfortable combination. You can't he, beat he this can't shit. can't never find no polo shoes he like for real. Mm. I got me some polo work shoes. They on the way. Okay then. They oh, on the way. Now. Oh, you about to step in dog shit and polo? They hiking shoes. They made for all this shit. Yeah, you about to? All right, man. I, I be avoiding dog shit. I don't really. It, yeah. Oh, it, it find you. It'll find you. Wait till wait till you. <laughs> you'll see. Oh, <laughs> uh, I I'll go to you know, folks. I, I pay more attention to the dog shit than the job when I'm. These, them niggas be like, watch out for the yard bombs. No. Like, all right, all right, thanks. I can smell them though. Clean up your yard. Clean up after your dog. Got people coming over, walking through your yard. You know it's shit everywhere. Shame on you. This ain't the farm. Get your life together. I'm not pulposcoping. You don't got people coming and walking through your yard, neither. The pest control man go. <laughs> oh, you said you got a pest control. Oh. Where's my boo at? Boo. <laughs> Some shoe song, right there. Yeah, I kept calling them footsies, and they kept being like, what the fuck are you talking about? Put you some shoe song, nigga. Yeah, you, you do got shoe covers. <laughs> them shits don't work. This shit go right through them. Yeah, <laughs> right, right through them. Now you got to pull it off. Man, uh, pretty normal week for me. Um, see, oh, I had the kids this week. Had spaz on my son. No. He been in school bullshitting again. Man, all right. Been bullshitting. I just be getting emails after email. The teacher's trying to hurry up and make everybody pass because it's getting to no. the end of the year. I be getting emails. Look, I'm going to put up with this little nigga, but right. god damn. And the, and the emails is so fucked up because it start out like, if you're receiving this email. <laughs> no, if you receive them, is you kidnapped? That means your child's on the list. <laughs> no. Like, ah, bro, why you made the list, bro? So, yeah, I had to do a whole the lot list. of. I had to do a whole lot of mean dad this week. I didn't it enjoy it. like a scary movie. It's tiring. It's so tiring. And and you know what's the the caveat of it is I know that in two days none of that mattered. I <laughs> no. see. <laughs> he go. He go. We have, I'm about to do this all over again. In like, two more days, man. Damn. Yeah. Yeah, but no, it was, it was a cool week. Cool little smooth little week. Goddamn, got the kid. I get to have him for another couple weeks. Oh, okay, then. Oh, shit. We riding now. You know how I be with the kids. You know, we finna, we, we doing shit. We finna go outside. It's starting to get hot. We finna goddamn go outside and sweat somewhere. No. We finna go buy some water somewhere. We finna go make some white people uncomfortable. Man, no. We finna do all that shit. How y'all go? What y'all gonna do to the... Never mind. I make white people uncomfortable wherever I go. I make police uncomfortable, so... I don't think I make them uncomfortable. Everywhere I go, if like I could be in the fucking car in the police directed traffic. If I pull up to the intersection. Oh well yeah, no, nah, that do oh that mean they uncomfortable. Oh uh, he uncomfortable. Uh, well, then I he do make them uncomfortable. Right <laughs> <laughs> he ain't comfortable no more. He was I make comfortable a lot of before them you uncomfortable got here. Then. He uncomfortable now. Be right, so what? Do your job. Hell. I'm finna say that too. I almost made a post. All y'all policemen out there that's that's out here doing the cross. Uh, the crossing guard job when the crossing guard called in sick. They get your mad. bum ass out the car and do your fucking they job. They don't Lazy do ass shit. ain't doing they shit. Upset. They upset. Ain't doing shit. You get demoted to crossing this guard. This nigga got out the car after all the traffic was gone and put his hand up and told me to go. That's what happened Bitch, to Martin. I know already. Martin and we are after bad boys was crossing cars. <laughs> That's what happened <laughs> after you shoot up the city and you piss off the chief. <laughs> Bitch, you oh, that's all the police that's in bitch. trouble. Yeah. <laughs> that's why they, they don't want to do that shit. They already your bitch off. ass out the car and direct some traffic, stop some cars. Goddamn, you barely got a job. It's terrible dropping kids off in the morning. Do your job. 
Mike, how your week been, man? No. <laughs> uh, it's, it's been good, man. There's a lot of school and yeah. a few little family issues. But, uh, you know, shit, that's about it, man. Just, just the regular school and doing work and teaching and uh, doing some music stuff. So That's, that's what's it. up. I, mind. I did have a couple little family things that I found out about that was like, good God. Yeah. Here we go again. It ain't never to do. Look, what the year is it? Twenty twenty five, my year. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Wait, this year gone like so 20, far. Twenty twenty five, my year. It ain't even May yet. <laughs> twenty 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 five. Here I come. It ain't me April. Me and you, twenty twenty five. Me and you. It's just the third month. <laughs> we still got time this year. We still got time. You win twenty twenty five. You win. Shit. We can't give up yet. Jeez, sir. Oh, um, what we starting with? What we getting to? How we going to begin? 2024. <laughs> yeah, 2024 it's for your man, niggas, all right. <laughs> Tyreek Hill experience of 2024. How we going? All right. Yeah, I'm just, and I don't, what the fuck? We going to play the clip because I don't this my see. Pee. We live, Mike? Must be an electrical fire right. because the smoke is getting thicker and thicker as the fire truck stand here. So Rick Ross. There's a video right now. He, his house is on fire. Not Ross. More and more helicopters. His neighborhood is on fire. Oh. Turns out, it's Tyreek Hill's house. Oh. But I'm sitting there one day on radio, and the oh, whole thing Hill is about your goddamn house, house being on fire. <laughs> Bro, what the hell happened? Shit. Bro, I was no. at practice when it happened. Shit, crazy. First of all, I just want to say Rick Ross, bro. I don't... I can't vibe with you now, bro. I can't fuck with you no more, no bro. More Rick Ross, man. Like, you ain't even come over. You had the audacity to talk to a fireman and stuff. Like, you over. got my number, bro. You Where you gonna come knock on the door? This bitch on fire. Like, after what me and my family went through. <laughs> he throw no water in my house. <laughs> Tyreek Hill, I wasn't picking on you, homie. I wasn't picking on you at all. He wasn't picking First on of all, time. I'm assuming you are all pro wealthy. Great homeowners insurance. He is all who gonna go get the new person. porcelain floors, marble walls, especially in my pillars. Man, okay. So it ain't nothing to pick on you about. More importantly, your beautiful mother and your family were straight. They were. Sh <laughs> I know it, was, it, it wasn't. Oh, he I wasn't know, that was it. That was I didn't it. Film that was it. Yeah, that was it. Yep. So Tyree Hill is mad at Rick Ross because Rick Ross went live and didn't. I don't, I don't know, like, like you so, said, throw some water on that bitch, Ty or knock on the door, or goddamn, I don't. Tyreek Hill, for those who don't know, is a wide receiver in the NFL. He's who we play for. We know he's amazing, and it's crazy because he's the size of Spud Webb, and he's shitting on niggas. He led the league in receiving yards and all that shit, even though his quarterback had a horrible rating. Like the nigga is, he's he's the fastest nigga in the league. Like he's a bad motherfucker. Who this nigga play for? Miami. Okay, then. <laughs> now, right. you, now you see that. Right. And I swore because I watched the Hard Knocks, the, the HBO series where they follow somebody throughout the season. Hell. And the last one they did, the most recent one, was Miami. And I could have sworn that during that season they showed Tyreek Hill having to leave because his house had caught on fire. This story that they're talking about right now. Hey, I'm saying maybe. So he waited till now to tell Ross, I don't fuck with you because you didn't throw no water on my house maybe back Maybe he had to have a plan for him to say it all. <laughs> He had no. He he been waiting to say this shit for a he while. Been waiting. He been mad. You can't be mad at a nigga. Why not? Fuck that. Why Fuck not? you, man. For Fuck what Rick Ross a, supposed to do, goddamn. He, he he told. He said that's the people you supposed to be. The people champ in Miami. Don't be putting my uh my burning house on your. I didn't hear him say the media. nigga name. I didn't hear him say his name at all. He just said oh, it was you a house. About Ross in the first yeah, video. he said it was a house. It was helicopters. It was goddamn yeah. If yeah. these, if the motherfucking house down the street catch on fire, he might have said it though. And this helicopter, you know, that was a little there, clip. And this fucking fire trucks and shit. I'm probably gonna go live out there, bitch. Too, oh no, I'm definitely it. going live. So yeah, fuck, that. and I'm not gonna come bring your doorbell. I'm not gonna bring no buckets of water. I ain't got no extra fire, fire truck in the there. back. None of that shit. <laughs> I I can't help it all. What the fuck? <laughs> You I got two water guns, one of them small. Hey, I ain't it. Got a Super Soaker 50 and a Super Soaker 250, bitch. What the fuck you think a nigga finna do? Motherfuckers only shoot 200 feet. Man, okay. <laughs> and that's under optimal condition. Hey, man. <laughs> ain't no two. fucking backdraft in my face, feet. nigga. Yeah, yeah. that's it. Started from a child. No, Damn. so somebody was in that motherfucker. 
Damn. It sounds like me and my mama curtains. All I, I was just kids. about to ask, did y'all ever almost burn down your dwelling hell as a yeah. child? I set the curtains on fire once. Yeah. Hell Purposely yeah. too. Well, I mean, not maliciously, purposely. <laughs> no, just I didn't have that. Like, you, yeah, you no, I, 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 I put the light yep. to the curtain. Tell them little kids, dumbass kids. I didn't expect. Fuck these the kids. curtain was made out of gasoline. <laughs> God, I didn't know that, but shit, that motherfucker went straight the fuck up. They just put all the lighter fluid on it, right? I when thought you did I that. was just gonna light a corner and put it out, like ooh, <laughs> nah, fuck that. I got to go in the living room, like, hey, uh, the curtain's on fire. Man. What you mean, like, like yeah, you know, like fire, like that bitch in the room. <laughs> It is big. <laughs> didn't even panic or nothing. Didn't no, put well, no I, urgency into it no for point. them to know I, to hurry up and I don't put the no fire panic. out. I never panic for real. I don't fuck panic. I mean, urgency. You didn't yeah, put any no, urgency into this. Listen, if I'm clearly speaking, <laughs> I'm portraying what the fuck's going on. That's Pay attention. Urgency. Yeah, listen. <laughs> The curtains are on fire. <laughs> Listen. Yeah. <laughs> if you paying attention, like, oh, okay, let's goddamn <laughs> act. Yeah. <coughs> I come in there screaming, waving my right. hands and shit. I'm going to have to say it about 12 times before you be like, oh. No, no, nah, nah, I'm going to set my kitchen on fire. My son said it very uh, urgently and clearly. Okay. So see? He, was, he was in there doing homework. I, I secluded him. I this, this was a while no ago. I don't goddamn it. Yeah, no, nah, you gotta have some urgency about mm -hmm. you. Fuck that. It's it's good not to. I'm not a, a panicking person. Shit slow down for me in yeah, situations like, like that. Like I don't, um, excuse me, y'all. I don't hurry up and panic and shit like that. But uh, Mike, you ever almost burned down your house as a child? Uh, nah, but I did play with a lot of matches and 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 fire. And <laughs> He's like, no, nah, I'm better. At I tell you, what, <laughs> he put it out. I was like, ooh, look, I did it. I did. Like it. I, I had a cup of water next to me Man, what for the matches. Stupid. I tell you, one time, uh, had some friends down the street. Um, we took some uh, twelve gauge shotgun shells mm -hmm. and um, live the, rounds. Took the powder out of them. Okay, used to it be live. A, yeah, it was a twelve oh. gauge, and um, he put it in the hubcap. Y'all wild. And um, so we put up. We put probably about six, six or seven shotgun shells, gunpowder. Gun, that's a lot of fucking gunpowder. Yeah, in a hub. And I didn't, and I didn't. What do you it. mean, like in a like hub? a metal hubcap? Like yeah, like, you car. Turn like it wasn't on the like car. You just laid it on the ground and filled yeah, it. Yeah, someone like in the street that he found. Now he was orchestrating all this stuff. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> you just uh -huh. yeah. And you I just watch it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, all right. Yeah, <laughs> probably of sure. No, I got some more shotgun shells. Yeah, <laughs> well, you I did. If you gonna do it, do it. And so, so he put him in there, and and then he go, he's gonna light it, and then he lit it with a match, and. What a match! Yeah, he bent down. You got to be uh, close as hell. And, and, yeah. I, and I was, I was backed up. Yeah, and, and it, no one just still. He, he lost all his hair on his legs, eyebrows, everything. <laughs> hell <laughs> like, no! Like, did, yeah. did y'all give him a nickname after that? Nah, nah, okay. it didn't. It was just me and him. All right, and he made then, it out um, all right then. But nonetheless, he it ended was, up getting called Smokey or Crispy no. or nothing like that. Singy or something. Shit, it just scared Smooth. it scared the shit out of me. Like, man. I was talking about a big poofy. ass flame, man. Like came up from that other. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, definitely I me, imagine me that and my older sister were definitely pyros. Like my older sister had a lighter collection. Like yeah, I later never. on in our childhood. But we were definitely pyro. We I set so much shit on fire so many times that people don't know about. I did it that I used one to nah, set it cologne and alcohol and Vaseline. And you mix them and it'll keep it to never mind. I set a lot of shit on fire. I roasted marshmallows on the candle with a fork. I got caught that time. I got beat pretty bad for that one. <laughs> I don't know. I, I be wanting to say shit like say bad, the, the but shit. No, hell no. Because you will go to. <laughs> How about them Lakers? <laughs> Bron James needs a haircut. You just have to tell them in a dream is all. It happened in a dream. Yeah. It was all a dream. <laughs> Used to set shit on flames. <laughs> all right. Oh, uh, damn. I, I, yeah, sorry, Tyreek. And hopefully you do have some great insurance. Of course you got And ask. Ross is, like, becoming a great internet troll. So, like, let it be, man. man Come keep, on. Keep your fucking, keep lighters away from kids. The best yeah. you can. Yeah, yeah. I would say the best you can. Uh, I found a way. I found a way to make. Spot. We tried it. We thought we was gonna set paper on fire with a nightlight. 
We tried to, boy, we tried to burn no, anything. We, just cause. We probably had some issues. It sounds like it. Hmm. Oh, well. I'm we made it. y'all made it out. Nigga, Shit. we made it. <laughs> Shit, don't try curtains. Them bitches. <coughs> Oh shit, Rose. Uh, well, I guess we're still on sports, huh? You want to stay there? I guess so. Goddamn yeah, it, we're too it, close today. It up. You just we touched too close me with today, your knee, goddamn it. We too close today. Yeah, God, it's the same size I'm table right it was it. last week. It was scoot over. I'm in the spot I was. Unspotted. Uh uh-uh. uh. Where we going? I'm gonna to? put my spot on the floor. <laughs> I'm gonna mark the tape like we, we need mark a, the uh, cameras and lights right here. We need to. We can do that. We can do that. We can do that. The Apple Store had them put in their break room and everything. I'm going to get a rule and measure half the table <laughs> and put a line on this bitch. Yeah. You stay over there, guys. Bet that. Bet it up. My lighter off your side of the table, dick. It's mine if it come over here. I, I, most of it has to be over there. It can't just be something. No, nah, fuck that. You cross the line. It's like an end zone. <laughs> you cross the line. It's in there, guys. It's the line. <laughs> Shit. Uh, <clears throat> the internet has been going crazy. Well, at least... My humble, dry-ass timeline has shown a whole lot of women extremely upset about this next story. Kato, would you like to present what it to the What they mad people? for? I don't understand what they mad for. How old is these motherfuckers? Jalen Green? Brown? Brown, Brunson. ain't it? <laughs> Brunson? I know Jalen Brunson is an actual person. He plays for the Knicks. I don't know what this Jalen's last name is. Me neither, goddamn. Let me see if I can find that bitch. What your last Andrea. name, Andrea? Jalen Andrea sitting in a tree. Jalen Green. Green. I knew it was a. It color. was a I color was though. Yeah, you right had a color. Yeah. All right, shit. You said brown though. No, I said green and oh, brown. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and I just went with something I knew for sure. Why um, they was say Drea Michelle? Drea Michelle. And Jalen Green. She's thirty nine. Mm-hmm. He, he twenty two. He's twenty two. And. They just announced that she is pregnant by him with his first child. He is an NBA player that plays for the the Houston Rockets. Okay. Yeah, you know I mean. Now, also, let's not leave this out. What happened? Drea has a son that happens to be twenty two years 22 old. Twenty two years old. So the internet would now like you all to know, as as much as I want you to know, that Jalen Green has a 22-year-old stepdad. 22-year-old Jalen Green has a 22-year-old stepdad. Stepson. Son, I'm sorry. Stepson. Yes, 22-year-old he stepson. Somebody got a 22-year-old stepdad. Yes, damn. <laughs> Dreya's son has a 22-year-old stepdad. Hey, all right, hey, fuck it, Jalen no. Green has a 22-year-old stepson. Why the fuck y'all mad? Fuck that. How did, what, you don't, that that nigga you really feel that way? Stepdad. Like you, you care about age difference in adults? I mean, it, I wouldn't do the shit, but I don't give a fuck that they did the shit. Hell, I mean, she the finesse this young man, <laughs> but still, man. fuck it though. It ain't yeah, I ain't mad at him hell. So, uh, I bet the son like uh, I, I wonder how the son feel. I so, what she? They said she thirty nine. So I, I'm thirty nine. So I got I I have a twenty two year old daughter. And a twenty two year old wife. Yeah. You go you ain't gonna look at me no, no kind of way? Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> with, I know you. I don't know them. So it's yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Is it different if a dude does it? Yep, I think so. <laughs> I think this that's different too. You leave that little girl alone. Oh man! No, you should leave the little boy lost. Would it? Would it? I'm like, yeah, yeah. I'm about to say, would it? The little girl just signed the contract. Yeah, okay. <laughs> no. What is she up to him? But yeah, fuck that. I can't, I if can't Serena get her pregnant. was twenty two and you was fucking Serena when you was thirty nine. Yeah, yeah, that sounds wild. <laughs> I guess I don't know. Yeah, I guess it is wild when you really think about it for real. It's wild, and uh, yeah. So the women, um. Women of all ages are very upset. I wouldn't even say grown women. I almost said all that, but of all of them are very mad about what that woman is doing to that little boy. Is how they put it. I bet he ain't mad about One of them what said, she's doing to If him. that was my son, they'd still be pulling me off of Drea right now. I mean, you would be in jail. 
And your 22 Yeah, that's who be pulling you off is the police. They still be with All that lady. Them. They be putting the, the little fish net over your head so you can't breathe or spit. And you're going to have a restraining be... order. You can't go to your son's <laughs> house no more, guys. They going to be wheeling you around the jail in that weird ass wheelchair that don't make sense. That Hannibal left ass wheelchair. Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> don't fight that lady. What does she win? Oh, don't, don't damn. Don't fight that lady. Oh, she I look like about she that. physically fit. Too. Yeah, no, nah, Drea look like she might be able to give don't you a good three lady. minutes of fisticuffs. <laughs> okay. God damn. That's a long time. Don't fight that That's lady. a long time to be fighting with fake body parts. Don't be embarrassed if your daughter in law whooped your ass. Oh, my God. You ain't finished with the dressing yet. Everything's <laughs> given. Like, she's just talking shit. Who she the gonna fuck make you go get macaroni? the bags out the car. Man, what? <laughs> your mama made this bullshit macaroni? Hey. Don't fight that. What do you think that, uh, that he's not mature enough to make a decision about this, and he's just caught up, and he pussy with. He just got. I think this. He got this out, uh, I, don't, I can't say for something. certain, but it's it's very likely that that old lady put that pussy on him. <laughs> he know how to act. Put the pussy on. Yeah, it's very likely that she didn't finesse him, and now they they stuck. But do you think that this is gonna come to an end soon? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe not. Hopefully not. Hell, maybe they'll grow old. Well, (laughs) 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 something like that. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. (laughs) Something like that. (laughs) They might not grow old together, but she'll grow old with him. They'll both get older at the same time. Yeah, 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 yeah. They'll age together. How about that? Yeah. This fucked up. They not gonna grow old together, guys. They not. Man, all right. not. She already. She like, already she halfway done. Old now, guys, she man. halfway done. She gonna be old as hell. There's a lot of people who don't make it to 39. She, she halfway done. You right. With a good natural life. <laughs> like, yeah. You right. That's hey. fucked up. You think it's selfish to have kids at an old age? Not if you got it like they got it for real. Even if you gonna die soon. But I mean, she she <laughs> might got you got by thirty four the most, so yeah, your kids would be thirty or forty. You straight hell, long as you're not like sixty having kids. <laughs> I know somebody that had too old. Yeah, yeah, I know. I, but I mean, even that that ain't really selfish. Hell, just it is no. what it is. Hell, but like the, the Robert De Niro, didn't he have a kid not too long ago? I don't know. Right, I with don't the know. real young chick. If you're rich, fuck it, it don't even matter, God damn it. Yeah, it's 79. It's 79. 79. Yeah. What? Robert, Robert De Niro. And, and there's another old dude, old actor dude that just did it too. I want to say Al Pacino because you want to say him with Robert De Niro. I don't think it was Al Pacino. But, but there was it. another really old man that had a baby very you recently. Just start with a really them young early woman. when they be about three, like, yeah, like, Pop's going to be Pop, Pop going to be here <laughs> okay. for about two more years. <laughs> <But ew. laughs> if we lucky. But she a fuck this. What you Damn. think, Mike? You think you think everything smooth with Dre and, and Jalen, or you think that's fucked up? Or? Yeah, I really don't know much much about it. So I yeah. mean, just that a thirty nine year old woman marrying a, a recently become millionaire twenty two year old man and getting pregnant. Yeah, and getting pregnant. I mean, I I mean, it is what it is. I mean, that this this dating with age gaps. So, but yeah, I, it's not something. Seven, 17 years? Okay. It's not something I would do if I was a 22 year old millionaire. You know what I'm saying? Right. I would be married. I mean, I'll say this it is, it is unusual. You, for, you gotta, that. Isn't that, that, that to me is the only argument that comes to mind for why I could see why someone would say he's particularly not mature enough. You gotta make that somebody, somebody, you. Ain't because I think in there are corner, like, hey, um, right, and he probably you a might have there now. Like, I think, you, I think he, I think he found his mother and what he wanted because a lot of men, that's probably, I look for that or when you know what I'm saying, try to cater to that. You know, you, really you know think what I'm saying? True? Like, I hear that. But that, that happens yeah, a lot. Do y'all look for your mother and your mates? Not all women, men do that. Nah, no, not not as <laughs> a blanket I statement. Don't. No, but I'm saying there is a it's a it's a higher number than we like to think it is. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, because how did where do you learn it from first? And the most in your life is the one woman that's been majority part of your life. If you, if you had a mother or a mother figure in your life, yeah. maybe that's what it is. Because I ain't never really been alone with my like, mom, so maybe that's why you got to realize why you attracted to a motherfucker if you attracted to a motherfucker. Well, that that if tells you realize me. like yeah, I'm attracted to this motherfucker because this motherfucker 
Remind me of my mama or some shit. Then yeah, you probably should get up out of there. Just that nurturing, you know that, that. I feel like that takes a lot of mental and emotional maturity that, you, yeah, to yeah, be able to realize no, that. No, absolutely, it do that. absolutely. Yeah. But again, that's why I say that I my thought of why he probably isn't mentally 22. mature enough. Aside from his age, because I do believe that there are some people who, especially when you're somebody that has been in the spotlight for all your life and you've had to deal, you got to, when you're somebody that makes it to the NBA, you deal with some other stresses and mature a little bit in yeah. some ways, at least, than other people have to or yeah, will, because yeah. you're going to experience some things nobody else has experienced. Everybody doesn't just become a grown ass wise man, obviously, but yeah. it's obvious to me, in my opinion, that if you just made it to the league and you just became a multimillionaire, and your first thought is I should marry this 40-year-old woman I met. That tells me, like, you, your mind probably ain't in the right place. Yeah, he was thinking with his dick. Yeah, well, that mind yeah. was in a place. I don't know if it was the right place still. But but look at it like this, too, though. Who who would know more than what, like you said, you hit on all the life experiences that she's had versus what he's had relationship yeah. Or what love or long term or whatever, you know what I'm saying? To be married to somebody, maybe he just find a security, a safe space in it. But she definitely to put that game or that or that or that nookie on him, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. but it but it might be something like Boy, but it all our relationship with somebody come with something else. Whether it's a younger woman that typically, you know what I'm saying, gonna get more pushback and not not have enough of like life experiences to be ahead of know what you want and be able to be in the capacity to give it to somebody. Too. She might know what she is, like this young yeah. nigga millionaire. Let me sit there and show you. Oh, hell yeah. yeah. All, all <laughs> the yeah, skill no, sets she, she done learned though. You know, so I'm saying the young like you said, young bitch oh, might young not bitch might. Nah. young bitch might not act like this guy. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah we seen all these relationships in the public. She gonna be bucking. They be yeah. trying to get cars and purses back and all that. Man, okay. <laughs> Fuck around, be what was that? What was that one with the OnlyFans? Fuck around, be like him. Right, you know Joe, I've been Joe, doing this. Was yeah, Joe, Joe. Joe Smith. Joe, yep, Joe Smith. Joe Smith wife. <laughs> she didn't get a name. The OnlyFans girl that Adam fucked. That's her name. <laughs> Man, what? <laughs> it's fucked up. But yeah, she done finessed the one I named. All right, he's here's, here's my last support. question, real quick. He's gonna be on child support in about, about is, two years. Is, yeah, definitely. Is he faithful? Shit, I don't know. Maybe hell. Mm. I don't know. He might be. Why yeah. not? I'm going with no. You don't think so? <laughs> no. He I'm might a... be hell. If you got a hell of fied, if you got a hell of fied, uh, <laughs> prenup. Or, no. That's true. I haven't seen anything in the news about like prenups like if if it's something that he know that. But yeah, I mean, you always take a chance. But if he protecting himself, nah, he, I think he'd be good. But he, I. I he young and it's gonna be so much thrown at him. I, I, he I, on I err on the side eventually. If he's he not, it's gonna, it's I gonna think hard. it's gonna be hard. It's gonna be a fuck. baby in two years. Like, it's gonna be hard as fuck to be faithful. <laughs> it's gonna be a new baby yeah. in two years with a with a thirty year old, a fucking twenty four year old multi millionaire. It's gonna be hard to be faithful, goddamn. Man. But you could do it. They might be madly in fucking love, and we don't even could know. Be. They could be head over heels forever and ever. Fucking she. Nope. We don't even know. It yeah, could, they could be. be. It could be. We don't know. Nah, it's just, nah. yeah, it's not they, likely. They, they might be now. Shit often now, so it ain't likely. The question is, how long can they be madly in love? Mm -hmm. the, you know, you know, that's the challenge. The, the honeymoon phase. Oh well, he got millions. Mad. They got a baby. All y'all mad? Didn't change my day at all. <laughs> don't be mad. Don't be mad. They mad because they ain't get the baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Miss, don't be mad. Get and she looked better at 39 than a lot Man, of people that was saying shit. I don't think that's too bad of an age gap. He is a little young, but... 17 years? Yeah. Is that, um, did I do the math right? No, I'm just saying the wrong I number. Shit, over I don't know. 22, that, you said she's how old? 22 and 39. 39. Yeah, seven, 17 years. 17? Yeah. Um... Yeah, that's a that's a gap. But I he, thought but growing he a up, man, my parents though. were five I mean, he's a grown years man, apart. Technically, by societal yeah, technically, terms, so. But also, he his first decision as a grown man and a multimillionaire was to marry a forty year old woman. Well, surely he protected himself. I hope, I so. hope so. At least man. the people in this corner should tell him that nah, much. Facts. Green, Get protect the green, Jalen Green. God damn it. <laughs> Jalen Green, protect the green, please. She out sir. you. She didn't got you, guys. For man. you and y'all's child's she, sake. She, she already got the child support, so. Yeah. Just, Probably some that. alimony too. Make she gonna sure be able to make a claim too. She old now. She can't make money the same way she did before. Make sure she don't get everything. <laughs> a half of. What was you? Was you? Was, what did he say? You wasn't here when I was shooting. It. I don't even know no more. Fuck them songs. <laughs> it don't even matter. Fuck them songs. Fuck all them songs. 
Damn, how do we end up with so much sports? Are we still in, let's get it out the way. We still on sports. What else sports, goddamn? Mike Tyson. Man, all right. All right. He's re coming out of retirement. Again. To fight the one and only Man, all right. Great White Hope. That's a great white hope. Jake Paul. All right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. What well, other white boxer gets notoriety these days? I get. I don't know. I don't pay much attention to boxing, but I guess me either. But I always see him. I guess most somebody. of them is Spanish, ain't it? Yeah, or black. Yeah. I don't pay attention to boxing. But you go to MMA, shit. you get some white folks and they're fucking niggas up. Man, all right. <laughs> why the fuck the see? And then I don't want to sound racist, but you figured fucking why the fucking Asians ain't like winning MMA? Like, <laughs> A lot of them don't do it. I'm, I'm, but if they like. A ninja should whoop everybody's ass. Well, you, you got to go through all your ninja training first and get yeah, done with that. Yeah, but I'm just saying. That's your whole life. One or two could have came out by now just like. It probably really is some ninjas that could whoop them niggas that, ass. I know. Too. It got to be. Goddamn. A Shaolin monk or some shit. Some, yeah, because that time I, I watched this thing on, on that monk, the dude trying to become a monk, and he shit, had to run right. up the stick right. that he was that using. you holding, yeah. He had to run up there, the monkey on the pole. Shit, all That right. was a car. He did it finally, they got but I don't know how. I guess the monks ain't going to do it because they peaceful and shit. But a ninja, I'm dead yeah, peace. A ninja got to be able to come out here and whoop their ass. I'm just saying. I always yeah. thought about this shit. Like, why would you? Nah, know? remember when it first, I don't know if you do, but when it first, first, like, started getting televised, they had this one match with this tiny Asian man. I'm sorry. I don't know if it was Japanese or Chinese. Little, little Is Asian, Asian man. safe to say? Or he was, he, was, he knew What's karate you? and shit. Asian, Asia covers the whole continent. It's safe to say. Yeah, that's the one. It's an Asian I'm person. trying to be political. Yeah, it's like Latino for all All okay, All right. All right. It's, all right. Yeah, yep. Learn something new if you didn't know. Uh, yeah, it was a small Asian man who knew some type of martial art against a very, very, very big black dude. He whooped his ass too, did Yeah, he got him. See? He slept him because the black See? dude almost wrapped him up. He almost fucked up. No. <laughs> he almost, don't he gr- thought let he, him he grab thought he had got him, but the black dude kind of got woke back up and about him the mud. But yeah, it's a really old fight. And I'm t- when I say I'm not exaggerating how many bigs or large I no. put on there. However many, that's how many that black dude There's a deserved. lot of bigs. He was huge. No. He probably was about man. 400, almost 500 yeah. pounds. No. Yes. Like he was really sumo and so wrestler. little dude so. whooped it, man. All right. I believe if I remember correctly, I think the little dude won. I'm just saying. But that's shit's different now. The fighting is way different. The rules are way different. The rings are different. Like they did that in the boxing ring. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like they could they could dominate this shit. But what y'all think? Mike and Jake. Mike Tyson, Jake Powell. I mean, obviously. <laughs> that's not right. That's yeah. not fair. But Jake, get your money. Cause goddamn, that's all he been doing. You right. He been boxing and getting money. If you like to box and you enjoy it, this is that's crazy. Jake Paul's though. living the dream life. That's crazy, right? You could become famous. And if you got enough money. You could just participate with your fucking role what models in do? whatever the fuck. Like, you could just... Michael Jordan, LeBron Jordan, let, let's have basketball let's have a, guy ex- Exhibition, me and you, one on one. you go with my head, but fuck right. it. Who can say right. they did this, guy? You know what? Man? I'll play Deadless Shrimp first. Man, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but in two years, I want the card. Me and you, one on one, Mike. That is wild, though. Motherfucker got the money to just fuck You know, he I fight Mike Tyson, Floyd that Mayweather, crazy. just all these niggas. It's crazy. He is living, but they're not he, real boxing matches, though. I, for him, the, the Floyd one wasn't for sure, goddamn. Yeah, I mean, they, but for Jake, it is. They're not sanctioned. Yeah, no, so no, they're not. They're yeah, not but they still boxing yeah, matches. But ain't, ain't nobody matches. supposed to get knocked out either, though. It's I don't like know. a charity type shit for real. This, I don't know. He be swinging. Now he didn't knock some folks out on. Yeah, no, before. some of them motherfuckers yeah. he be fighting, but the big names and shit like. They just in there for real. If Tyson fight him for real, yeah. man. Yeah, like this shit over. It's like an exhibition, more or less. Think... I get it, but it might if, if when when he come in there and he do what he want to do. <laughs> but if he start hurting him, I think he's gonna back off like yeah, that's 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 that person. The champ like, is here. Tyson gonna fuck him up, man. He like he's way more f- focused and everything now. I wouldn't that's... put Mike. I wouldn't put it past Mike accidentally dropping him. Man, okay. Now, he'll probably drop him, but if he realized a point that just like did you remember that one fight he had against I forgot who it was, but it was an exhibition a few years back, and he, he was him? hurting his ass, and then he started backing off like Roy, I don't want to. Roy Jones. Roy Jones. Yeah, and he okay. was like, I I ain't trying to hurt this motherfucker, but yeah. he could have if he if he kept on. He, he fought him on about a seven to me. Yeah, I if think, he gave him a ten, somebody getting hurt. I, I feel like Mike's gonna try to knock Jake out. You think? Yeah, he and got I a lot hope of mouth. he does. He got a lot of mouth. I, hope I don't he think he goes. I don't know. 
I don't even like Mike Tyson. I fuck with Mike Tyson. Yeah, I fuck with Mike That's Tyson. That's my favorite That's boy. Yeah, I grew up, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Mike Tyson, Muhammad Ali. Every time he get to talking to people, it, it rubs me the wrong way. No. I don't like it. I don't like the way he talked to people. Yeah, but he's still a tough guy, guys. Yeah, <laughs> I don't got to like him. Have, have you went back and watched his older fights? No. Man. Well, yes. No, I'm lying. Yes, because I don't understand how that nigga ducks so close to people so often. Like, how oh, you yeah. lean forward like that Motherfucker right rub, in the nigga grill? Rub his forehead on your chest. Man. <laughs> rub his forehead on your chest. But yeah, wasn't no way to dodge block see anything about that uppercut when he came back up mm-hmm. out of that duck. She was nasty. She was nasty. But yeah, no, I, I guess, yeah, get the money and shit. Do what you yeah. doing. I, if I was Mike Tyson, I don't think I'd fight this motherfucker. He said no for a while, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, yeah, I, I don't, I don't think I'll I think fight Jake's this been motherfucker. trying to get Mike in the ring. It, I, he probably gave him like have, something stupid for real. Like, bitch, I give you $10 million. He had to. I mean, he him. built his name. Jake built his name up. It fair, it's fair to say that he's put in the work to get to this point as far as celebrity exhibition. Facts. Exhibition. I don't know why I can't say that word today. Exhibition matches today. Um, and who you would want to fight and who you would want to see, especially as one being the regular. Average Joe person, I don't quote see unquote, Mike and the other fight. person being the celebrity boxer. Like I don't want to see Mike Tyson fight nobody. Not nobody ever. Yeah, what not, about not, The Rock? Not no The Rock. What about Batista? These is wrestlers. What about? Now I don't want to see Tyson fight none. Nick, like Jordan when he came back, you should have stayed gone. Goddamn it! The forty five comeback hey, or the one before? The Wizards come back. Okay. <laughs> I'm about to say, hold on, which comeback? <laughs> when, when he shot his foul shot straight like the, that. The Washington comeback, I did. Be like, how come ain't no arcing? The flat Jordan, foot like, comeback. Wait, yeah. wait. Like, Jordan, you forgot. Just stay gone and goddamn live off your legacy, goddamn it. I like it. I, I like it. You old, you want something to do. You you want to move around some more. You still love the shit you used to do. You get to do it and it not be some serious thing. I guess that's, so, that, that, that's true though too though because you you still get to do it because he clearly love it because he still work mm-hmm. out still do it but I I really don't see nothing wrong with it because he he he's not trying to do it for real like in right. a, like take it from the Devonte Wilder or whatnot you know right. what I mean you're not training for like, six months and and doing lead ups to the fight and going ahead like not like you're not a trying real to take fight. over the vision and get a yeah. belt but I, don't I, I can see, see it for Jerry fun Rice but. and Troy Aikman <laughs> in no motherfucking football game. I don't want to see Wayne Gretzky. Not even, a, no not even an exhibition no, game? I don't want to see this shit. Somebody going to pull a hamstring. I don't know, man. They slow. I, I can't I don't lie. I want to see it. An old head exhibition game? No. Nah, That's what I'm saying. That yeah. might be fine. Emma Smith, stay at push home. Shannon, push Shay Shay out there? Hell no. Nah. He don't even <laughs> walk the same no more. He don't Dion, walk the same no more. You know Dion missing toes. He got enough toes. Uh, he can't yeah, go out yeah, there. Yeah, ain't right. He can't go out there. <laughs> that nigga got three toes on one foot. And somehow them bitches spread out. Hey, he'll still walk down, no problem. Yeah, he's, he's, he's hey. He lose hey, I ain't lying. He gonna lose that his might balance. be wonderful to see. Hell no. Nah. An ex- a old head exhibition game. It'll be I, like uh, I don't want to see these old Cube, niggas Ice Cube, out figure it out for us, man. Yeah, I don't want to see the, the old <laughs> niggas play basketball. Ice Cube, the big three, Mm-mm. big three, do the big, the big old NFL. No, <laughs> don't bring them niggas out there. You gonna so ask, you, your insurance <laughs> got to be fine. They no, uh, you all signed like waivers covered. and disclaimers. No, if you get hurt, it's on you. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah that's a lifetime injury at that point. Man, okay. you, know? <laughs> you got much lifetime left. It's, it's so old. many broken hips <laughs> out this week. Lifetime almost over. Hamstring. No, that nigga lifetime. broke his hip. Goddamn <laughs> man. Hey, that would be hilarious. Concussion. Had, no, nah. that nigga had a heart attack. That would be like the new puppy bowl. No, it would take over the, the airways. Senior, the senior bowl. Yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> the elderly bowl. I don't want to see this shit. The elder bowl. I don't want to see this shit. I like it. The elder bowl. Nursing home team versus private care team. <laughs> yeah. Straight up. And everybody on the sidelines dressed like RNAs and shit. I don't want to see this shit. I don't want to see this shit. And they could do like flag football, they got, though. They be got as scrubs bad. on on the sideline. Mm-mm. The coach got a doctor coat on. Somebody going to get hurt. <laughs> Too many people go get Yeah, hurt. somebody might end up having a heart attack. You know they man. is. Niggas out here running and shit. <laughs> All right, we could limit it to the people that still like work out and shit. Like you saying Mike Tyson still work out. You still see him moving around and shit. We seen that video before he did the, the other fight man. with uh with I smoke, I drink. What's up? What was his song? What was Roy's song? It wasn't I smoke. What's that, that was it? it. That yeah, was we it. seen. He stole that from Boosie. <laughs> yeah, he did. He did. But 
We seen him. I seen the hip movement. That nigga, when he did like that, yeah. it was a few. He know how to it do went that really shit. fast. He could still hit hard. He said it's like riding a bike, goddamn it. Well, he got to be some niggas that could put the tights back on. Hell, I don't want to say. I mean, they can do it. I'm and just and not going to appreciate it on. at all. They ain't going to make it with the pads, homie. Come Man, on, nah, the, I uh, Put the thing, the <laughs> plays on your wrist. I'll be out there doubled over, <laughs> goddamn it. <laughs> You so just got to oxygen it tanks. Just, the, the football team might have to be like 130 <laughs> people because you're going to have to go through three So three many sets. subs. <laughs> even, even the coach going to break a hip out there. You you two feel? plays each, <laughs> goddamn. Hey, man, coaching in the wheelchair. <laughs> yeah, what? An electric one, too. Referees, <laughs> they the all too. Yeah, no. Let's not do the senior bowl. Did all y'all right. did y'all watch any of the UFC knockout this weekend? Mm-mm. The UFC no. uh, with Anthony Joshua and Francis uh, in, in Ghana? And Ganu, man, yeah. it's pretty tough. Yeah, yeah. That boy, he got, he got knocked out. He he didn't get up. No, like, it was pretty tough. Yeah, that UFC, I I like. That's the you talking about where they be having the show, where they or is this just a fight? No, it was a fight. Yeah, not when they be having the show with the two teams and shit. Uh uh-uh. uh Oh, Okay, okay, yeah. I know something. Yeah, no, I don't nah, watch was, none uh, of this shit. Yeah. One of the USC main events. Yeah. Oh, okay, I don't watch no sports no more. I don't do it often, but I often my TV is left on ESPN though. Yeah, but I'm not always like actively watching the shit. But that shit got fucking. They play Sports Center too many times, back to back to no, back. No, they got to a whole bunch of shows now. They don't do it as often. They don't anymore. do this shit no more. No, it's a whole bunch of shows on there. Motherfucker, you just cut that bitch on and watch the same Sports Center all goddamn eleven hours day, man. What eleven is? hours. The fuck is y'all doing? And they didn't even like now when they redo it, they refresh a little bit. Like the niggas redo it again live. No, see, they, like they, they back then, they just had the one episode. tape. The one time you Man, did what? it, put this bitch on, put it right repeat. back on, put it back on. Fuck y'all doing, nigga? Let me do a show, shit. I ain't know what to talk about. I don't. But watch yeah, sports. I ain't paying for no pay per view for no shit. I don't think I ever had in my life. Um, this shit so coming on as soon as Netflix, Jake and Mike. Coming on Netflix. That shit coming on Netflix. They did do some pay per view shit on there. Oh, it's pay per view still. They had a pay per view event on Netflix for. Uh, oh shit! I figured no, it, it wasn't pay per view. They had a live yeah, event for they, a sports event. It was a golf t- playoff or something. I feel like if it's on pay- Netflix, then shit, all right, well, shit. Need to come with my subscription. I'm watching. I would say I'm just gonna wait for it to hit YouTube and watch the free shit. You know what I'm saying? It should go up every motherfucking six months too. What do? Netflix. Oh, yeah. They ain't, they ain't playing. That bitch get nice as hell. That bitch used to be goddamn nine ninety seven ninety nine. dollars 99 goddamn it. Ah. Shit, all right. <laughs> all right. That bitch uh-huh. finna be $75, goddamn it. For <laughs> the same fucking shows. And niggas want to laugh about paying for cable. Man, all right. You about to be. All right. Uh-huh. You might as well be. <laughs> shit. <laughs> Oh man, everything, everything in the world come right back around. Four, another seven dollars, God. No, it ain't much. It's just seven dollars a month extra. It's just extra. If, it's if you don't want commercials, if you want commercials, don't worry about it. Shit, all right, man. Um, fuck TV. What you want to go to next? Shit, I guess we out for sports, God damn it. Finally, we on the wars <laughs> now, God damn it. All right, fuck yeah. it. Yeah, um, more time. Tell me about Sweden joining. <laughs> Neutral company. Neutral. I said a company, goddamn. Oh, them two. They that too. They too. <laughs> <laughs> I've been neutral since forever, ever. Our water is neutral. <laughs> wait, wait. Now nah, they like, yeah, now nah, let's join NATO. All right. Wonder what the fuck Sweden got going on. Yeah, so as, as most people know, Russia and Ukraine don't like each other a whole lot. And they haven't for a while. So they've been beefing and shit, right? They've been beefing. NATO. Uh, NATO the group of all the countries around the world that's supposed to be the, a team. The National It's supposed to be. Is, yeah, I all know. I know. Because I read it it's earlier. It's organization and I don't at the end. I don't know what the T for. We could look it up, but we're not. Um, we're not. I don't know why we're not. I just, we're, but we're not actively. So. What's the NATO stand for? <laughs> The National Atlantic Treaty, the National Atlantic Treaty Organization, the North Atlantic (laughs) Treaty (laughs) Organization. I don't know. I said national four times. Like, bitch, they don't (laughs) say national at all. It don't matter. The The North Atlantic (laughs) Treaty Organization. I had organization right. 
So all the countries that want to be down with NATO, want to be gang gang, is all supposed to help each other out whenever shit pop off around yeah. the world. It's like, you know what I'm saying? It's the, you know, it's the different fucking sets in a game, but then sometimes the sets might have to come together to go against a different gang. So that's what the countries do too. And NATO is one of the gangs. And now Sweden is one of the sets. Who are we explaining this to? Black people. Man, okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, this made all the countries gangs, guys. You guys are welcome. Okay. <laughs> I'm listening like it didn't make sense. You like, follow yeah. it now, right? Yeah. So when this street and this street, they beat yeah. them. But if them from over there come over here, like, no, well, no, nah, y'all got to, yeah, exactly. Come from around here. All right. Type shit. All right. So, NATO, uh, Switzerland, as, as Cato said a moment ago, ever since I can remember, TLC had a song about it. I'm in Sweden. I mean, Sweden. I, might just, I was thinking, like, is this yeah, the same places before you say Switzerland something? Because Switzerland was neutral, too. Yeah, yeah. Sweden been neutral since forever. The Swedish meatballs. And also, along with them, Turkey, to it, no, Turkey didn't join. Turkey was the hater. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Target like fuck this. So this seems crazy, right? And everyone's like, oh shit, what's the world coming to now when Sweden finally allowed into NATO and they didn't really want to pick a side? And oh, is it that bad in Ukraine or Russia or Palestine or Israel? Or what the fuck? It's the last days. Oh no. The whole time, Sweden been trying to join NATO. Yeah, they just want some oil money for real. But Turkey and Hungary was like, we don't fuck with them. <laughs> so we don't really want them in. And you know what I'm saying? All the sets got to agree for the new set cup. <laughs> turkey and hungry. <laughs> but you hungry for some turkey, they been, bitch? Hey, they, they said that Sweden been showing like love to Russia over time. So, you know what I'm saying? We fuck with Ukraine. NATO fuck with Ukraine. They been helping Ukraine. That's why the U.S. been sending all this money. The U.S. is part of NATO. So they been sending all this money over there. That's why they been doing it. It's because they part of and NATO. And the weapons. Don't forget the and weapons. And the weapons. Yeah. All the, and the... Never mind. That Russia gonna fucking take when they yeah, never mind. <laughs> but yeah, so since since uh we we fuck with Ukraine, Turkey and Hungary was like, nah, Sweden over there, they fuck with Russia, These so we can't really trip. they can't I don't fuck with them. You feel me? And if y'all fuck with me, you can't fuck with them neither. So we ain't been fucking with them. NATO ain't been fucking with them. I don't fuck. But who in the meeting like I mean Ain't nobody was like, nigga, it's turkey and hungry for real, <laughs> nigga. Like, what, what the fuck would they talk about for real, for real? Is it not weird Them that hungry hasn't the changed stove. their name? Fuck this, hungry, nigga. You can't change the name of your country. Why not? <laughs> like, is you it's nigga tired of being hungry yet? <laughs> yeah, I am. I don't want to be Hungarian. <laughs> That's the next goddamn platform for whoever run. <laughs> He's hungry. Why is it called? Stop. What? I feel like, I just feel like by now, urinal should work better and hungry shouldn't be the name of a country. Fuck that. I'm not, you can't change the name of your country. Why not? Uh -uh. They, they, they no, done it no over time. no patriotism in that. I don't think Djibouti still exists. Djibouti. It should. It I don't think it does. Should. Maybe it does. Don't but there's lots of that countries shit. that's names been changed. Don't do that shit. There's no patriotism in that shit. No, nah, it's patriotism in not being called hungry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you guys a lot, a lot of pride. There. Stay hungry, nigga. <laughs> stay hungry, nigga. We do everything y'all do. We hungry. Man, what? <laughs> we you stay hungry for it. <laughs> when you fall and you sleeping because you got the itis, we still out here looking for food, nigga. We hungry, nigga. Shit. <laughs> Were you not malnutrition? Man, okay. We are. <laughs> when you waking up, you smell the bacon whiffing through the air and shit. We, we do don't do none of this shit. We out here looking for it, nigga. We trying to get it. We hungry, nigga. Never for nigga. No. Nope. Fucking starving. Watch out, little bitch. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, change our goddamn name. Man. Change that motherfucking name. Yeah, so I guess there's them. another reason the world's coming to an end. Stuffed. Um, last pod, which was an enjoyable pod, don't you agree? Yeah, sure. I learned some shit. You say, yeah, sure. I learned some yeah. shit I ain't, I ain't know. <laughs> I still um, can't 
Bitches like ugly niggas. Yeah, that was crazy. Y'all gotta see. Y'all gotta watch the last episode. Bitch, bitch apparently, bitch. Never mind. Like y'all gotta watch the last episode. I I enjoy. I my whole life I've grown up around females, so I always just like being around females. I ain't a man. I ain't a man. It's just what I prefer. So I, I'm glad a couple of them came through and sat down with us while we did an episode. But they did inform us of some things that just isn't. I guess it isn't the way a man's mind works, and that's why we need them around sometimes to let us man. know. What happens on the other side of the tracks? Because I can't they did comprehend. both say. At the same time. Yeah. <laughs> like, adamantly agreed with that. Yeah. Bitch. Is, is this true? 256-788-7339. Ask the smokers at gmail.com. Y'all Women, prefer a nigga that's a little ugly. Y'all prefer the ugly niggas? Because don't nobody else want him but you. That's why you be waiting till you with your man to smile. Never mind. That's what it is. That's what it is. What it is. You got the you ugly nigga, you, you can just control. smile at the handsome <laughs> nigga. That's what it is. <laughs> Bitch, fuck y'all. Because the way them, man, the way them hoes looked at me when I walked into one of them stores today. No. The whole four of them behind the counter. Watch me walk in the shit and still watch me like I ain't walking. Man, okay. Like, Goddamn, bitches. That's um, enough, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> like, I feel I'll be back by. Hey, Calm man. down. Hey, what? <laughs> quit oogling. I gotta leave. Oogling, oogling. Yeah, quit. <laughs> quit oogling me, bitch. You is so. <laughs> <What? laughs> oogling me, bitch. Is that the word I did? It, it used to be. Man, okay. I don't see nobody. <laughs> I'm old, goddamn it. Fuck that shit. Yeah, all this shit. Oogle. The bitch oogle, motherfuckers. Oh, shit. <laughs> we're oogling niggas. Oh, man. What were we talking about? What happened? These oogling bitches. <laughs> I don't even remember no more, <laughs> God <damn. laughs> Oh. Oh, shit. You want to go to the clip or you want to talk about the grip? The gorilla the grip. The clip or the grip? Fuck it. You sound fucking enthusiastic about the grip. Tell me the about gorilla. the grip. Oh, that's what I was starting with. Like, so last week, I wanted to bring this topic up, especially since we had a couple females. Excuse you know, me. Uh, what do we go? What do we call the, the people that just join us? We gotta. We we need a name for like the repeat can, offenders of like the we show. Should, shouldn't it? Like All right, later. Smoke buddies. Yeah, the smoking buddies. We had a couple smoking buddies come through, and uh, but they don't all smoke though. That's true. Well, later, later we'll figure yeah, it out. What? Um, and I wanted to bring this up. But I put the notes down wrong in my in my phone, Damn. and she, I just got laughed at while I tried to frantically search for what I would what she I meant. Use the tablet. Well, I use my. I just I don't I don't even remember where I heard the story from to even why I had it written down. Like I had no reference point for why that was in my phone at all. No. So it didn't help anything. But then I saw the story now again later and was like, "Oh shit, that's the Fanny." You did say I Fanny was talking. Mayo yeah, I was said Fanny May. Yeah, it's a yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you did say Fanny May was selling pussy. <laughs> yeah, I said I and put something on Fanny May. Yeah, need people money if she's selling all that pussy. <laughs> yeah, sorry, Fanny May. Whoever you are out there, ain't sorry. Ain't that the long bitch? It's nah, long. that's Sally Mae. We I talked think about it's y'all. Sally Mae and Fannie Mae. I don't think. I think I made Fannie Mae up. No, I think Fannie Mae. Was <laughs> I think I, just... I don't think that bitch an urban myth. <laughs> she the black school. Who is Fannie Mae? <laughs> Federal mortgage assistance. Oh, so maybe that's not for the, your house. Different loans. So <laughs> like, hey, I have heard of Fannie Mae. Not sorry, Fannie Mae. <laughs> maybe they're mortgage. assisting with the mortgages. Man, okay. I don't know, Fannie Mae. Holler at me. Let me know how you do things. Hey, holler at me too. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give me a real turn. Nigga gets a real turn. Damn, I still say it wrong. It's a real turn. Yeah. Okay, real tour. Yeah. It's All not right. a. Er, it's, I said cockroach wrong my whole life. No, That's what I get for watching Scarface. It's a cockroach. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a cockroach. I always just say roaches, but if you say the whole thing, I thought it was a cockroach. It's not. It's not. I'm stupid. Um, Fanny Willis. Fanny Willis. That's, that's, <laughs> right. that's a bit different. That's a bit different. Yeah. All right. Fanny Willis is the person's poo nanny that I was referring to okay, last man. week. Okay. And I'm that's why I was a little excited because I got it right this time. Oh, and man. got a little better since then. Oh, <laughs> so old oh, Gore story. Oh going. I wonder, do I have do I have what I said still? 
I don't think I said she was selling pussy. Yeah, nah, you said Fannie Mae was selling pussy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you said Fannie Mae was selling pussy. No, no, no. Oh, uh, I think I might have got th- rid of I it. I think you deleted oh, well. it after you realized Fanny Mae yeah, was selling pussy. Selling no pussy. <laughs> it's very possible. You don't see it. Oh, okay. well. um, she got to come up with the money they have for these mortgages somehow. So Fannie Mae was introduced to most of the world. It's not Fannie Mae. I mean, Fannie Willis. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! Hey, we sorry. sorry. It's our it's sorry, mistake. Mate. No, come over right, here with Fanny that bullshit. Mate. Fanny Willis. Well, okay. Miss Willis, Madam Will, uh, Attorney Bruce's wife. What? What is she? The district? The DA? DA Willis was introduced to most of the world, at least the country, um, in the year 2023. When she decided that she was going to clean Georgia up. Oh, okay then. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this then. bitch. And she indicted everybody. Young saviors of the Lord. Man, all right. <laughs> Freedom guys, man. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Please, Hallelujah. Guys, until it's backwards. Okay then. <laughs> yeah, um, Fannie Willis is the the DA that indicted that put the Rico charges on on YSL. Um, Trump too, wasn't it? And Trump. Man, okay. <laughs> and Trump, along with 18 other people with Trump. Yeah, she out here bugging. And so now, she's been on trial. Of course. The people who are supporting Trump and fuck with Trump was like, hey, yo, get this bitch up out of here. okay. <laughs> get this bitch the fuck up out of here. But here's why. Fanny was out here fucking. No, Fanny been fucking. And she was giving somebody some money when it was happening. No, Fanny was giving away the Fanny and the money. <laughs> oh shit, Fanny! Hey, why ain't no? Why don't no money rhyme with Fanny? Hey, That's okay. all you tried to find. I tried to find something. I was trying to. I got money. Yeah, no. Um, yep, she is the she Fanny. Dropped the them panties. Fanny, Fanny dropped panties. Fanny dropped panties. Fanny was in there. Yeah, <laughs> Fanny, Fanny dropped, dropped the panties. panties. Yeah. Um. So she was fucking, and whoever she was fucking worked with her. And while she was trying to get Trump put up. Damn. And uh, just she done it. shot my man a little bit of money a couple she was times. paying for it. I was hoping it was a hood nigga somewhere. <laughs> yeah, no, I believe he, he works somewhere around her. Another politician um, there, nigga. I don't know if he's a politician, but he's... In there he, somewhere. He wasn't... It wasn't D, D-Rod off the block. Like, man, that's what I was hoping. <laughs> It wasn't John John. John 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 fucking the goddamn senator lady. It don't matter what you're doing, politicians, you're the senator lady. It don't matter. You walk, you working in Washington and you wear a suit, bitch, you the senator lady, bitch. You deliver mail at the newspaper, you the senator lady, bitch. You fucking the senator lady? The one with the blue suit all the time? The white truck. She got a briefcase. Send it to like they find it there. I like it. They do be, hey, it do be sometimes walk around in little skirt suits. Man, okay. Come on now, send it to lady. She ain't made. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Fanny with the panties. Come, the ship come down. Come down yeah, with me in the right. ship. It was taking us all down. <laughs> Fanny with the loose panties. Yeah, so uh, they found out that. She was fucking with dude, and she was potentially spending some funds that weren't hers to spend. Oh, it ain't even our money. So they got she mad and was like, taxpayers money? that's the Trump bitch. Get her off the case. Get her, get her out of here. I don't we know ain't fucking though. with it. Matter of fact, take that bitch to trial. Take, take that, that bitch to trial. trial. <laughs> I don't know. We hey. don't care if she a lawyer. We going to take that bitch to trial. <laughs> this bitch spend the taxpayer money on dick. Well, she... Hey, that's why it started bubbling at first when I last week when I she been on the stand with an attitude, snapping it there. She, oh, yeah, she be bucking. She been just, that, 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 that. And I said it. If you had to ask me, yeah. that, like she been on the stand going hell, right? You would think she got blue hair. <laughs> yeah. She be playing sexy red with well, you. Okay. Car. You know she do. Fuck you mean. A maybe car to be a little bit, a little bit more sophisticated oh. red to a little bit more. Who? Well, they were trying to prove, you know, the, I don't know the right word, how substantial their claims were about this relationship and uh, what level this relationship was at. They wanted to prove that Fanny had to lose panties. Okay. And she had to lose pockets, too. Right? 
So they went through my main phone. Just like a bitch would do. Just like a bitch Just do. like a bitch Fucking do. government. Well, all right. <laughs> Guess what he had Fanny Willis what saved you? ass no. in his phone. Senator Lady. <laughs> <laughs> Blue suit, it bitch. Be, man. Okay. <laughs> it got, no, it wasn't, the, it wasn't the nigga from the block, no. Never mind. Right, yeah. <laughs> Gorilla Grip Cover Pussy. No! <laughs> Gorilla Grip Pussy. <laughs> Not government chick, damn. With emojis. No! <laughs> Shit, all right. Fanny got that gorilla uh, grip on nanny. <laughs> Fanny with the grip on nanny. All right, then. You losing this trial, Fanny. You can't. Fanny, <laughs> Fanny with the grip. No, she win. What you mean? What you mean? She losing. She Fanny losing. Fanny with the grip on nanny. <coughs> she losing it. The dude. Oh, that's that right. They, <laughs> they wasn't supposed to be fucking. That's right. That's right. They wasn't supposed to be fucking. Got you. Yeah. Yeah, it's you fucked up. gorilla grip. Whoa. Damn, Fanny. <laughs> yeah. Shouldn't have gave up that Fanny, Fanny. <laughs> Damn. Oh, shit. I ain't never done no shit like that. Ain't no way I would ever save no one. Really, like real pussy. Man, okay. <laughs> That's wild to say. Why the fuck it don't just say Fanny? Man, God, three times. Like, what? That's the bitch's name? Man, all right. Why would you put that in your phone? Like, just put Fanny in there. Or send her the lady, I be bitch. Ask, I be asking females, what, what you got me saved as? No. Don't, yeah, I don't want no, don't, because females do that shit. They'll do that shit. They I don't even want to know. crazy shit. Nah, I want to know what might pop up if no, I call No, man, all right. <laughs> I want to know what might show up on your phone if I call you. Motherfucking name, lunch. They come lunch date. <laughs> no! You hungry girl. Lunch date calling. Right. Man, all right. <laughs> Wait a minute, bitch. <laughs> Go, here comes Biggie Bag. Man, what? <laughs> no. No. That's a DNA. Eh? Do not answer. Four for four. <laughs> Motherfucking name nice Scat Pack in there. Girl, Scat Pack calling. Girl, your phone says Scat Pack. You better pick it up. Man, what? <laughs> nigga no, that just mean he not fast. No. Damn, damn. Bitch, Man, just... okay. I thought the nigga had a Scat Pack too. God damn it. Damn. It's fucked up. She's sneaking <laughs> with it. That's fucked up. She's sneaking. Um, <laughs> that nigga see his name like, bitch, I got a Honda. What this oh, mean? Man. Why I say scat pack, bitch? I got a Honda Accord. <laughs> a 96. Wait, wait. This bitch ain't fast. <coughs> you is. <coughs> Oh, man. No. Hold Ooh. your hands above your head. No, nah, I'm hot now. <laughs> this shit work, yeah. man. I'm telling you. <coughs> they got me with that when I first started smoking. Man, that shit worked. me a couple times. Dumbass shit. Tell uh, me you did it and it ain't work. It didn't work. See, you did it wrong. Nah. They used to, matter of fact, they used to tell you to do that after track, too. You can't breathe. You been running. You ran a mile. Yeah, nah, they be like, walk it. Don't sit down. Stay still. Walk. Put your hands up above your head. That shit ain't help shit. You gotta stretch your lungs at. Man, fuck that shit. There ain't enough space in here for no lungs to need stretching. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. I don't fucking know. I just learned the shit a few months ago, goddammit. Yeah, I ain't know why they told me to do it, but I just know it ain't never helped me none. Ooh. This shit tastes like tires. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Yeah, skirt, scat pack. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Um, I guess it's it's time for our clip, fellas. Mike, where we at on time? Uh, hour ten. Okay. All right. All right. Do you hydrate? Drink a I will not say sixty-four day. ounces of oh, a water a day. Water. That will drown you, and it will flush out all of your minerals, and it will flush out all of your amino acids. So make sure that you're not drinking a gallon of water a day, even if you're dehydrated. The the less you supposed to drink is probably around, I say, thirty-two ounces. The most you supposed to drink is up to fifty what ounces, especially if you're drinking water. juices because it's super hydrative. Okay, so you don't have to drink your water. juices like that. Now, if you are drinking some type of spring water, don't drink don't drink no sixty-four ounces a day. 
day. You know, stay around that 50 ounce area at the lowest 32 ounces, y'all. Because, you know, a lot of people get edemia. You get very edemic from it. And again, it literally flushes out all of your minerals. So make sure that we're not drinking too much water. Water is very H2O. It's very toxic when you drink it in large quantities. And that's the reason why they do not give it to babies. And they tell you don't give it to babies unless your baby is six months to a year old because they know the toxemia of water and how it flushes out and how it imbalances the electro uh, light spectrum inside the body. So that's where you hydrate. Oh, I, I will not want you to look up there. But yeah. That nigga don't sound like you know what you're talking about. I, and I didn't even find the actual video that I wanted to. It's from the same person. His name, his name is either Yaki or Yakai. Okay, Y A K A. No, Y A H K I. Okay, then you. Like, yeah. Yep. Like a woke person. Okay. And right. his second name is Awakened. Um, okay. But the original time that I saw him speaking on this subject matter. <laughs> don't drink no water, then. Don't drink. Don't do it. Uh, he said that you're supposed to eat your water. And that's why he's telling you not to oh, drink okay. it. Okay, so I used to be eating like vegetables that's high in water. Like fruit. Yeah. Okay. You, you shouldn't. We're not supposed to drink water as humans. You're not supposed to consume water that way. And if you ever, if if you just pay attention to nature, all the animals that do drink water, they have to lap it up. So they only get a little bit at a time, and they don't get that much water. And there's a reason for that. And we're not supposed to be drinking the water because it'll flush out. It's, it'll overdo it, and you'll have too much in you, and it'll flush out all the stuff that you need in your body. Yeah, not in nature, so the, the, they drink a lot of water. No, they eat it. Them, <laughs> like the elephants that got them trek all the way across the fucking continent to come back to the same water every year and drink all this shit and then leave, goddammit. Maybe they eat enough water to drink. That's that's day 32. It just looked like more to us, but they elephants. So that's just <laughs> Yeah, they, they know. Oh, you okay. got to wake up. Oh, you gotta, I'm, I'm <laughs> did you know, sleeping. Mike? Did you know water is bad for you? Yeah, I I, I seen <laughs> I seen him before, and uh, I follow uh, some of his stuff. He he got some good stuff on yeah, there. No, it's, like, it's, it's more like the it. holistic approach. It's uh, it makes sense. You know, uh, fruits that have a water in it, such as oranges, watermelon, uh, honeydew, or even cucumbers and mm -hmm. certain kind of grapes, tomatoes. Um, yeah, uh, a lot of places you can get the the water nutrients that we don't get. But that's true because you remember back when they I don't know if you remember, but when WZYP had that water uh, drinking contest and somebody OD'd on water. On yeah, the, you can't the drink too much in that. You can't drink too yeah. much. ZYP killed a nigga with some Man, water? Man, You could get, that, like, yeah, water yeah. poisoning and shit. Damn. Um, but that's just because you done drunk, like, a whole bunch of I thought you shit. ended up throwing, throwing it up. I thought your body just get rid of it. I guess if you keep on going and you don't throw I don't know. But Man. you can get water poison. I know that much. But you got to drink a lot of that shit. But yeah, I mean, a gal in the water, like, that seems like a lot too, goddamn it. Right. And I be seeing motherfuckers with these big ass goddamn pictures say every fucking 30 minutes you done drunk this much water. Like, yeah. you yeah. gonna pee on yourself. Yeah. Keep on, but. Yeah, I did, shit. I just drink a few bottles a day yeah. riding in the truck and be about to pee on myself. That's, I can't wait till I pass the gas station, goddamn it. Maybe you need 32 then, 12, 24. 36 God. yeah that's that's what right. he recommended was 32 minimum and no more 50. than 60 something no more than 50 yeah he said doing 64 is bad yeah no more than 50 but yeah i mean i guess if you can get which is an interesting amount of ounces of water compared to the i guess it's just because that's not the the ratios that we usually get offered water in to end it for you to end up on 50 yeah. i see recommendations yeah. of uh 80 yeah so, I'm sure there's all kind of, and everybody body different. And true. just living, just being born in another country and living there your whole life is gonna make shit different. You might right. need 52, and and, no and your lease. It probably depends how less. active you are too, though. <laughs> you know, if you're moving and stuff, you know what I mean. You dehydrate and do different yeah. things. So you work I guess out it, every day yeah, or run a few miles every day. It's yeah. gonna be a different water intake. But just I guess he's saying eat eat more of your water than drink. Have a balance. Yeah, you know eat your water. It. Yeah. It's more convenient to drink this shit, though. I'm just saying, because the niggas ain't just riding around with folk. Uh, I wonder how right he there, feels man. about smoothies. Because that's a little mix. That's all yeah, you're still you, drinking. Yeah, you out of drinking this, what though. you were supposed to eat. You're still drinking it, though. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what about ice? It depends on what the ice might be. I think you could technically, eat, you technically could, eat a smoothie, though. 
With a some spoon? of them depends yeah, on how yeah, smooth absolutely. it is. Let yeah. me taste smooth. But no you more. could chew on some. You could. <laughs> <laughs> if you need a spoon, that bitch ain't smooth, goddamn. <laughs> This ain't a smooth it no more. This is stiffy. Never mind. It's a slushy. Oh, slushy. No, yeah. it ain't even slushy. Yeah, you can slush, use a spoon you with a can like, Well, you can. I guess you can. You're right. Some of them smoothies, you can't. Them motherfuckers be like the Dairy Queen cup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you hold that Hard bitch upside down, shit. it's not a smooth it no more. It's just ice cream. Cup of ice cream. Hey, <laughs> hey, that's the that's the play. We got to open up a smoothie shop called Not a Smoothie. No. Just everything but smoothies in <laughs> No, it's bitch. only smoothies, smoothies in that, but they, you can turn it upside down. <laughs> so we got ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not a smoothie. Man, okay. Fuck it. We in there. <laughs> we gonna build it? I don't think so. I don't think so. I think I'm gonna. If we build it, they'll come. I'm out on this one. <laughs> I'm out on this one. Oh, man. I just thought it was funny uh, to pop open my phone and watch a video with a nigga who is so intense and adamant. And I wouldn't. I, w- I almost like him to Dr. Umar just for the energy that he gives off sometimes when he's explaining stuff. But um, he is very adamant about his teachings about his lifestyle and or your lifestyle and being oh, healthy yeah. and motherfuckers stuff. Who, so I, I enjoy opening my phone and being told to eat my water be and that I've been doing it all man. wrong all my life. They gonna press hard. <laughs> Bitch, you drink it. And let me see you with one of them big ass things of water. How y'all feel about man. milk? That sounds like a stupid question. Man, what, yeah, it, but it, like you think that shit yeah. is healthy for you? No. I'm, I'm, yeah. I don't know. Shit, when you was a baby, I guess. I don't know. They said it was... I didn't have reason to know that it wasn't. I would drink the shit until I liked milk until then <laughs> I couldn't drink milk no more because it made me shit. <laughs> oh, you lactose intolerant now? Yeah, I am, yeah. Oh. Oh, I mean, but no. not like, I can still eat ice cream and shit like that, but oh, okay. I can could, I could eat one bowl of cereal. <laughs> but if I eat another, Why you don't just get the lactose milk? That mean, that's what I do now. I got oh, almond okay. milk now and shit. Oh, okay, then. Yeah. So the almond milk work for me. Yeah, I sure used to think, but I used to drink all kind of milk, think it all for to be small. Yeah, I just they like me what it tastes like. Yeah, I liked it too, but I was like, and I'm gonna man, okay, <laughs> and I'm gonna look like Popeye out this bitch. I don't need no spinach. Like shit, I was happy as a kid drinking milk, and then I had a, a chemistry teacher in ninth grade. <coughs> And he told me this theory that he had oh, okay. one day. We were just shooting. He was a cool ass dude, young, younger teacher at the time. But um, we were kind of shooting the shit. Me and a couple other kids in the class we was just talking to him. We didn't really have to do shit in class that day, so we just chilling. And he told us this theory that he had about milk. And he was like, "I think that milk is the reason that old people got fucked up bones." And I was like, "Tell me more." Because <laughs> I thought it would probably be good for your bone. Right. <laughs> and he was like. Because we get told and it pushed on us so much growing up, and we drink so much of it as children and as young young adults, then you just stop drinking it. Man, yeah, your bones like what the fuck calcium all of a sudden, in there, bitch? Yeah, like you've been giving me all this motherfucking calcium. Right now, now you, you just got some stop. almonds in here, goddamn it! <laughs> stop, bitch! I need my. Man, right. <laughs> I think that's why they pushed it. I mean, we're we're the only <coughs> animal that doesn't drink our, our own, mother's milk, yeah. meaning. Gorillas don't go to cow getting cow milk for their babies, right. you know what I'm right. saying, or whatever might. But uh, but milk has and other dairy products been a top source of saturated fat in America's diet, contributing to heart disease, type two diabetes, and Alzheimer's disease. Damn, it make you forget. That's what's wrong and, with me. And, yeah, and, and I also nigga with drinking milk. I also heard Alzheimer's is 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 really just diabetes three. That is won't call it that. Word. That it leads that yeah that that, that all one. that um, leads to uh, Alzheimer's uh, as well. So that is the one call it diabetes three Damn. or type three. But uh, and also even studies have shown that uh, link dairy uh, links dairies to increased breast, ovarian, and prostate cancers. Oh yeah, it give you cancer too. But you mean we was young? They told us <laughs> the milk was good for your body. But yeah. you see, they don't push that no more. No, I seen one recently. I was yeah. like, I haven't seen a milk commercial since I can't. Yeah, I maybe two days ago. They indoctrinated us with that though. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like that you got to incorporate. They used to have all the, the so sexy, the most sexy mm-hmm. bitch. Got to have a milk. Uh, you got got milk. That's got what it milk. was. Well, even go back the milk further. And shit. When people used to have the milkman come and deliver to their doorstep. Yeah. Hell like yeah. they been on this shit. A lot shit. of you niggas dead. We don't talk about this. 
I'm just saying. Jesus, Kato. Ah! Yeah, I'm just saying. I don't think we need to. God, no, damn, man. Man, we here, man. man. We here now. God, they. <laughs> they ain't even know it. They ain't even know it. They ain't even know it. Never <coughs> mind. Oh, yeah, is it that time? Uh, yeah, it's definitely Let that time. <coughs> yeah, buddy. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, you're in for something right now. You're about to explain. This is the part of the show with us. Who? The smokers. Us. Give you. Y'all. The viewers. You feel the me? The listeners. Mm -hmm. Everybody. Inclusive. The best advice. Thumbs up. The ever been advice since the beginning of advice. You know what I'm Cisco talking about? Cisco and Ebert. All that shit. All this shit. Two thumbs up. You Rotten feel? Tomatoes. Five of them bitches. All of them. Stars. <laughs> all this shit. All, no, all, all the stars. Not mm -hmm. just five of them bitches. Constellations. You mm -hmm. know what I'm talking mm -hmm. about? Five mics. Since the they started the Constellations, ain't nobody had no advice. Better like the than advice the advice that we, that we found. Nobody in the Pilates. Right no, I'm None of them about. niggas. No, no, nobody who did Pilates. None of them either. Uh -oh. I don't know the niggas that did Pilates. Me neither, goddamn. I might start. <laughs> <laughs> this <laughs> the is. first thing I'll tell, goddamn. <laughs> Reddit on Reddit. <laughs> Already. No, I'm talking about. Who want to go first on Reddit on Reddit? All right, I'll go. Bob? Um. Oh. Man, what happened, Bob? <laughs> what happened, Bob? Asshole, he deleted his post. No. That's all right. Yeah, see, I've been screenshotting Yeah, I got a screenshot Bob. of it. I got a screenshot of it. Nigga can't get rid of your shit on me. <laughs> Every time I screenshot it, ready be like, why I don't you just share the post? I got a screenshot. Man, nah, nah, nah. <laughs> you tried to get rid of it. Hey, right. I'm going to still give you this advice, bitch. All you right. can't run from this advice. <laughs> Even though you don't know you need it, we know you need it. You, it you wanted it. You put it online. You wanted this advice. Shit. Reddit on Reddit number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. <laughs> Casey, Casey back Man. in this bitch. <laughs> the title is, this is a 20... 28 year old male okay, speaking man. about a 28 year old female. Okay, then, so I ain't made the shit. I found out that my girlfriend had ONS. ONS. With a close relative of mine in the past, prior to me dating her. And I'm wondering what to do. Now, first, I'm I'm, I'm going to have to know what the fuck ONS is. I don't know. I believe the S is a six. <laughs> the S is a six. Okay, so we broke that much down. <laughs> what the O and the N is. I don't know what You the know what it is, Mike? Nah, I don't know. It's a one-night stand. One-night mm. stand. Yes. <laughs> Found out that my girl had a one-night stand with a close relative of mine in the past before me and her were dating. Now I'm wondering what to do. Oh, uh, yeah, no. You got to get rid of that bitch. <laughs> you got to get that bitch up out of there. You got to get that bitch up. A close relative, too? Watch out, little bitch. Yeah, nah, you got to get that bitch up out Watch out, little bitch. She's just gone. Yeah, it, I'm, just, you got, yeah I, my advice is to get that bitch up out of there. Yeah. That's my advice. How you feel about that title, Mike? Um, it, it's over with. Like, I, just, I don't even really need to even hear the rest of the story. Right. Ain't nothing can change yeah. my mind. Like, if you have sex with anybody, but so it don't even matter, relative or not. Like, no, this was before them. Yeah. Like, before they, she said they had, he, they, he found out recently mm -hmm. that previously, like, before they were dating, his girlfriend had sex with a close relative of his. Uh, that's something I need to know before we get married. So, yeah. That's... Yeah, nah, get up out of there. Yeah. All right. Let's see what he got to say. I found out during a casual conversation about our families with my girlfriend that she had a one-night stand with a close relative of mine roughly two years ago. Oh, you talking about your cousin, James? We've been dating for almost <laughs> a year now, and I'm feeling confused and angry about this. Is there any way to overcome this, or should I break up? About it. I didn't know this when we started dating. I just heard it a few days ago. We have a great relationship going on. This really bothers me, so I'm asking for advice and thoughts from the community. Get 
But it was two years ago. Up. <laughs> out of. There. Damn. Get up out of there. It was only two years ago? It was only two years ago. Yeah, no, that's too recent. <laughs> that shit should have happened like when y'all was 13. <laughs> yeah, and was, what, what I don't like about the way he wrote that shit is you shouldn't have said it was only two years. Well, you shouldn't, he didn't say that. You shouldn't have said it was two years ago. You should have said it was a year before we started dating. I ain't no mind. that's what they've been dating for a year. Yeah, it was <laughs> shit, right. a year before we started dating. You no. fucked my cousin. Get but if she didn't know they was cousins, it don't matter. I mean, it ain't mm. like you, it ain't a punishment to get up out of there. It's just we not compatible now because you've been doing <laughs> shit too close you to over here. Yeah, us. yeah. Damn. It ain't no hard feelings or nothing. Yeah. It's just the world too small right here in Fa- this area. Family you know? events ain't going to be the same. Hell. We can't be the same. At the barbecue and shit, like you got to introduce you, motherfuckers you? like, oh, and, and, hey, this giant. Nah, I know James. I know, so, I know. Yeah, nah, hell no. Nah. I know James. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> yeah. But so are you gonna are you gonna be mad at your cousin then? You ain't you ain't gotta be mad at nobody. Yeah, you ain't gotta be mad at I nobody. I mean, you gonna feel some kind of way now. Still, she's gone, but you still gotta go to the family function. No, you see shit, your yeah, relative. No, fuck that. He ain't fuck my bitch when it was my bitch. Ain't nobody upset. Yeah. Okay. All right. It just is what it is. All right. I can well, fuck with I don't got like a song or a drop for moving on. But do it, bro. I ain't the man. That's what the you say? Uh, come from around here. Come from around me, God damn You got to come from around here, God damn That's the best advice you going to get. And anybody tell you different than that on some bullshit, I'm telling you. You can't get over this shit. I wonder why, how that comes up, though, in a casual conversation. I'm, you know, that was just like, yeah, yeah, no. Nah. And then who your people is? And then my people, and now, yeah, I got a cousin, yeah, James, that's my closest cousin. Oh, you talking about James with the colors? The, with the gold teeth? You got a scar right there. See, dude, <laughs> how you know James? <laughs> oh, see, you used he to fuck a, with my cousin. He got a grandmama name on his back and his shoulder blade. <laughs> <laughs> see, how you know? Wait a minute, bitch. Get up out of here. Get up out of here. Especially if you didn't know and he was talking about it and you didn't make, make the connection. Man. And then you finally made the connection. But all right. You know, she said it. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Gotta get up out of there. The world's a small place and sometimes it's too small. That's true. It, 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 that it's happening like this sometimes. We live in a city that's very evident of that statement. I ain't the man. I'm just saying. All right. Well, get up out of there. Who's next? Shit. Right. What you got for a mic? All right. Reddit on Reddit number two. Number two. Number two. My husband cheated on me at the bachelor party. No. Oh. <laughs> That's where you're supposed to do it. <laughs> no, you ain't supposed to do it, though. That's where you're supposed to do it. Man, this is your last night as a single man. <laughs> Meet me at the altar, not at the bachelor party. It's <laughs> you supposed to <laughs> get up out of there. Get up out of there. That was the title. That was the whole thing. Yeah. Oh, did it say how old they was? Um. In the title. Nah. Nah, we don't want to know you. Okay. Get up out of there. Nah, they don't Cheated say the title. They don't say the age. Wait, at did all. she say my husband? Yeah. They still got married. She didn't find out till after they got she married. She ain't get up out of her. Oh, uh, she didn't find out till after they got married. Now she mad. Yeah. And every time they laying next to each other. What she say on, on BMF the other day? <laughs> every time I open my eyes, I just see you laying with them. No, nah, man. All right. And it was probably a stripper or some shit. Get up out of her. Oh, yeah. You might have. Oh, I hope you didn't burn your wife. Oh. Oh. Man, all right. Let's see what happened. 12 years ago, we got married. Damn. I didn't want to know all the details of his bachelor party. Like, I already know strippers were going to be there all over him. But in short, I know his bachelor parties was typical. Bachelor party was typical. He went to the strip club. He got very drunk and then rented a bunch of hotels to sleep over the bar across the street. No! (laughs) My bad. For, For his bachelor's. His friend hired two escorts for my husband to choose from, and he chose the better looking one. We reunited with one of his friends in a conversation that came up. So the friend had told it. Oh, he dry snitched. The friend told? My husband looked unhinged while his friend was telling the story. I stopped and said, you did what? 
<laughs> I kept yelling and cursing at him and so confused. Um, he said I was acting ghetto on him. <laughs> 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 bitch, you acting like you got blue hair. Watch bitch. out, little bitch. <laughs> Watch out, little bitch. I just feel betrayed. <laughs> but it was more than a decade ago, and we had three children now. Happy marriage and a life. But it bothers me so much no. that um, he did this before we got married. It was a long time ago, but he never said anything. So am I the asshole? Am I wrong? And, and what should I do? Uh, I can't even tell you to get up out of there, man. It's going to be difficult to get up out that of there. That was 12 years three ago. Yeah, Fuck nobody. the 12 years. Three kids? Yeah. That's difficult. Uh, Damn. Happy marriage at this point. Except for, I guess, that. First off... I just whole ass free. I'm about to. That's what I'm saying. I just, that's what I just growled about. That nigga. Twelve that, years that's later. That's what I just made that noise about. Twelve that years nigga. later. I'm, man, I'm, I was just thinking, like, how y'all end up with this bitch ass nigga? Like, man, what? They must have. Was y'all? Was it? Because you said they happily married, good up to this point, and I'm thinking like, he hated nah, on him. They, him. nah, they really was like on a trip. They went on a trip somewhere to try to kind of get another spark going. They three kids in in twelve years. That's not mm-hmm. a lot of time to have three kids. Man, all right. that, they them kids is all oh, yeah, young they, still. They, they, Every day, the same like, age as yeah, like, like they had, they, he, he would have said triplets if it was triplets. Them well, niggas I'm not came the same ages, but yeah. yeah, but like a couple years yeah, apart from each other. Mm-hmm. Man, yeah, they tried to take a trip. They tried to go do something different than they normally do. I haven't done in a long mm-hmm. ass time to try to get shit back going with them because shit was starting to be a little rocky. And goddamn, he was like, oh yeah, and such and such lives there too. Whenever we go, when we, I got the trip planned already. When we go, I'm just telling them to come through and say what's up. I haven't seen them since the wedding. Man, what? I ain't this seen you boy. since that time you fucked them bitches. <laughs> Remember when I bought you them two hoes and you picked the good looking one? Right. <laughs> you won't fuck you the ugly bitch, bro. Room? I fucked the ugly bitch. I know you fucked the good looking bitch. She told me. I'll talk to them again later. I bet he's sitting there mouth wide open like, what the fuck? You acting ghetto. Man, okay. <laughs> nah, that's funny. She yeah. probably was, though. Man, all right. Makes it more funny. <laughs> all right. You know she was. You did what? <laughs> she probably threw some water on him and everything. Why you ain't fucked the ugly bitch, Dan? Why you ain't fucked the ugly bitch, Dan? I was about to marry her. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, okay. Mm. I was finna be with an ugly bitch. <laughs> but the rest of my yeah, life. Right. He said our kids bitches. One more fine bitch. Do you, do you think she can get through it? And how? Mm. I don't know. I mean, uh, I guess we got to get it with some advice. So what if, what if it was flip? How would y'all feel if it was your wife 12 years later you found out <coughs> at the bachelorette party, the same scenario, you didn't yeah, find out? One of the friends said the same. What, what my bottom line is no forgiveness. I feel like I might get over that. 12 years ago before we got married at your bachelorette party. I don't see I don't see that <laughs> happening in my mind. I might get over that. I don't that, see that. Damn. The pit, whatever vividly was created by me in my own brain once man, that wait. story was told to the world whatever <laughs> little video said, man, it's it's play there. over and over it's there man, for good. it don't gotta play over and over again it don't gotta be every day but it's there it's there and it'll pop back up are you gonna think about it before sex I'm sure if you if you see what I'm saying like, like, yeah, if you nah, it like man, that now right. you can only give me head <laughs> never fucking you again <laughs> no with a condom head with a condom damn <laughs> Yeah, you gotta you get might as well leave that. that. <laughs> yeah. You gotta get up, up out, out of there. there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, nah, I, I can't. I don't see. I don't see unseen that once I created that video in my mind. Yeah, that's a lot I, though. Three kids. That was a lot. They start over with somebody. Years, I think I'm gonna be like, yeah, it, it was right before we got married. Like, like bitch, I might like go a few keep hours. you one. Goddamn it. <laughs> I'm finna go cheat back, bitch. Yeah, yeah, because it was just right after I found out. So, right. so <laughs> it's still new to me. Yeah, it's a few hours after I found out. Twelve more years. It ain't. It ain't been twelve years. Yeah. I just found out. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Damn. That's a tough one. Yeah, yeah that's a tough one right so now. So you get getting over someone lying to you for 12 years about something like that. Well, they didn't lie. You ain't never asked. Yeah, yeah if you ain't never lie. asked. Now, if I didn't ask you if you ever cheated on me. Uh, you said yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, I feel you on that. And then you said no, and then, then maybe goddamn we on some different shit. Oh, but, that ain't cheating. Okay. But yeah, no, I don't know, though. 20 years and three kids. I to might, a woman, that's a lot. 
I that's might get over there. No, nah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. You ain't tell me. Guys. Yeah, that's a lie. Withholding <laughs> the a, truth is a lie. Man, okay. And I know at some so, point the man or woman is in the ass something about being faithful in some in some nature or another. Like you said, like because if then if you say nah from that point, it's definitely a lie. Yeah, now you lying, yeah. God damn it. But I guess you're really lying when you're cheating, for real. You being dishonest. No matter how you look at it, yeah. Without sex too. But yeah, twelve years yeah. ago with three kids. I might be I able guess to you get gotta lie to cheat. shit. Maybe. But you ain't gotta lie, but you gotta be dishonest though, God damn. Facts. With the intention. Man, mm-hmm. you ain't you ain't gotta really tell a lie, but No, you... I, but what if I wanted to fuck? <laughs> no, but you're being dishonest to <laughs> another you person. Her? If you ain't telling yeah, you've you been lying being to dishonest to you cheating on. I gotta tell her who I want to fuck. I mean, if if you want to be honest, <laughs> yeah. Like you said, no matter how you nah, skin that, that's I thought a lie. I could just be honest about who I want to fuck to myself. No, you can. You be honest with you, but you being dishonest to them. Oh, Long as you ain't fucking honest. nobody else, yeah. I ain't lying. Uh, to I, I think the only oh, advice I can see in this is just get some therapy if you want to work through it. Just some therapy, some whatever that is, it. something oh. medicine. <laughs> therapy, a therapy dog. Yeah, some some, uh, no, some of them chewies dog. to help sleep. The purple gummies. Smoke uh, a blunt with your you mom. Yeah, smoke a blunt with your mom. Don't don't oh. tell your girlfriends because they go they go <laughs> oh, yeah. eat you up out of there. Oh yeah, they go take you up out of there. <laughs> tell her, what we tell her to delete all your pictures you sent a to. A rental <laughs> bitch. Um, uh, whichever kid has some kind of name for her side of the family, change it. Oh uh, no! <laughs> all this shit up out of there. God damn it. This bitch didn't exist. Switch the sinks that y'all use. No. You, you <laughs> do all that shit. Yeah. Just get, get rid of the his and hers and put one sink in that bitch. God damn it. A big one. Hey, man. Take the door off that little room that got the toilet in y'all bathroom. No. Take the door off of it. Take the door off the bathroom. <laughs> Fuck it. Uh, and then you say, cheaters don't get doors. Yeah, all right. <laughs> damn. Boy, can't read this bitch. It's fucked up. It's twelve years ago. <laughs> That's twelve doors. How many no. more? We got <laughs> Damn. A dope for each year. Uh, shit. Fucking yeah. New um, years come another dope. Me no. personally, I don't. I and you know every every relationship obviously is nuanced. I'm joking, but the, you you do got to be in the situation to know every person is so different. All that stuff matters. Um, hell. She might not like the kids. Man, all right. <laughs> she might be seeing the, the out. Yeah. I'm thinking about it here, guys. Might be seeing the out right now. Man, well, I appreciate what you did for me, Toy. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> right. <laughs> Where you free man, at? Let me, I man. appreciate you too, hey, bro. Man. Anytime you want to buy him anything. <laughs> man, okay. <laughs> but fact, but you yeah, don't I have mean, to buy him something because I'm going to get half of this shit. <laughs> Except That's for the kids. Up, Except for the kids. <laughs> They're going to need some winter clothes. <laughs> They're going to need some winter to live. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, no, nah, it obviously it depends on the people. It depends on if both of them would be willing, like Michael was saying, to go to therapy um, and take it seriously and do all the work and blah, 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 whatever that entails. Um, it depends on if both of you could live through each other knowing about this moment of dishonesty or... Uh, Whatever term you would like to phrase the action that took place, um, you fucked the hooker, but a good one there. She was an escort, no, it wasn't, a, uh, no, see, <laughs> and it was the pretty one that they would, no, it was escorts the, don't it come was, in ugly. It wasn't, <laughs> he, said, what, he didn't say the pretty one, what did he say? The better, yeah, looking nah, the one. good looking, looking one, one. yeah, it, was, it has an exclamation, so the guy must have insinuated that the friend, um, yeah, like, and she was a bad bitch, <laughs> man, okay. <laughs> Damn. That's yeah, I don't I don't know. If y'all believe that y'all could work through it, if you believe that it's worth the chance and you think you could work through it, mm-hmm. um, maybe not call her ghetto anymore while she's mad. Man, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I got some a little bit of good advice. Don't do that no more. Direct, <laughs> real <laughs> ghetto, Kimberly. <laughs> this is how you act with your family. <laughs> This is why I did it. This is why I did it. This is, you act like this. I knew. It's how you are at your family reunion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. If y'all believe you can work through it and you're willing to give that chance and do it. But if you're anything like me and have any <laughs> any smidgen of uh, that video replaying in your mind, 
Random times. Yeah, you ain't gonna probably, get over the probably shit. Probably don't. Like you gonna remember the shit forever, goddamn. I, I got a question though. So what about is there what about would it be a difference between an escort and your cousin if you didn't find out till twelve years later? Nope. It's the same result no matter mm-hmm. what. I feel like, yeah. A random person ain't as bad. Escorting your cousin about on the same level, though, Because <laughs> an escort bad, but your cousin bad too, God Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I don't. I I'd have the same answer. I think pussies. your cousin would be worse, <laughs> but I still had the same response either way. Even if even if they didn't know y'all were cousins. Yeah, because oh, you yeah, gotta no, see your cousin. Different. Yeah, I ain't upset about this shit. No, nah, because you yeah, because you gotta see your cousin, and every time you see your cousin, you know your cousin fucked your bitch. No, you can't keep the bitch then, though. You can't keep her around. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. No, either way, yeah. she's gone. She had, I'm done. I can't do it. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Matter of fact, if you ever fucked before. No. No. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. You ain't been glad ain't no female here with this. That body right. count shit. You already know. They be spazzing on that. You going to jail, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> you going to jail. Hey, look, this is for entertainment purposes only. <laughs> the views and the opinions expressed by Bob is his and his alone. Ooh. And not yeah, the views and the opinions of the smoke. If you ever fornicated, don't look in my direction. I don't understand what you're looking at me for. I don't know why you would do something like that and then look at me. Reddit on Reddit, <laughs> number three. <laughs> number three. Okay. Number three. <laughs> <laughs> my girlfriend. Gave me the okay to find a side girl. Oh, hold on. I'm bullshitting. I need some sound effects. Oh, a side bitch. I think that's what he really wanted to say. Watch out, little bitch. Smoke some, bitch. You get it. You get the church one, too. Can I get an amen? Right. Yep. 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 Yeah, all that shit. All right. Oh, shit. Well, that's that, then. Ladies and gentlemen, that was ready on ready. No advice needed. Man, no. Okay. Just, just go with it. You need a sound effect. Dude from the last ready probably got a bitch he, 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 he can put you on. <laughs> and an ugly one. friend. The pretty one, man. Okay. What'd you think, Mike? What'd you think? Mm. Oh. Yeah, it's tough. Yeah, it's a setup. No, you fucking set up. Um, so that you gonna get some pussy. I guess it depends on if I've been asking for it or not. Oh, like did she give me the green light? The then it's been a conversation. It's but if it had been, like it. I agree, that's a setup. Like that's <laughs> a. Came hey. out the blue. Now. That mean, that I was talking to fun. my hey, friend. You know idea. what? I think I'm gonna give you permission to have a side. That means she nah, fucking. bitch. Nah, nah, she, yeah, yeah, yeah. Might yeah, well, yeah. Cause yeah, she fucking up. already. Yeah, that's another angle too. That's yeah, a that concern means, if yeah, it come yeah, out of nowhere. Yeah, I feel bad. That's what she was talking to her friend. She fucked. Stop. Let him fuck somebody. Let him fuck. Yeah, he's gonna tell this boy he can fuck somebody. Man, okay. It needs some more questions, man. So it sounds like it's just this uh, three it's in a row. You need to just get up out of there. This three in a row man, tonight. Okay. <laughs> you so, might need to get up out of there. Oh, shit. <laughs> I need a little more details, but yeah, it could be it could be some, that those angles there. But it 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 it's raised a few eyebrows if if it come out of nowhere. Let me see what we got going. Let me start by saying that I love my girlfriend of three years, but our sex life has been non-existent for the past year. I am 37. She's 36. I try to initiate sex and she doesn't want to. I will not force her and I end up jacking off. I should say that she doesn't like to perform or either. She don't suck no dick. Recently, she told me that she would to have sex with. Mm. While this might be the ticket that many men dream of, I truly like being monogamous. I would have to start over and grow dates and spend time with the other woman. <laughs> you don't know how to go. To, you just got to go get the pussy. You know, <laughs> my girlfriend. All right. My fear is that I would develop feelings and my current relationship would fail. I've had this information running in my head for six months. Six months! 
<laughs> and now I'm unsure if I should pull the trigger and just do it. What do y'all think? I need advice. <laughs> I I think you should just try it because it's going to be a fucked up no matter how you go. And just going to try it, see what it's like. Yeah, I mean. She got a bitch responding to it. <laughs> but, <laughs> <laughs> but, then, but then she also, like, it, I mean, him, if he go out on dates, he's going to catch feeling. He ain't that job just trying to fuck something. You might as well just. <laughs> That's what he said. He go catch. That's what yeah. I'm saying. Yeah, yeah you don't go out there dating the motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He said they go find a girl. I gotta friend. remember her name yeah. and her birthday. Yeah. I gotta know what she likes to eat. Man, what? <laughs> I guess my my vice is a hey, a bro or, or whoever uh, guy out guys out there is find a woman that like to do shit that she don't give head from the beginning. You already know that. Ain't, like, ain't no way in like, hell. Yeah. What? Like she don't do oh, the yeah, things you enjoy, years. you're gonna be in for a long ride. You ain't don't get no head. Three years in, yeah. So that's that's you tough. Got me fucked up. Why she yeah. ain't been fucking for a year? It, it, see, he ain't tell no us kids. All they ain't either. got no kids. I don't. He ain't say nothing about no kids. kids. They've been together three years though. Like she could have caught him with a man. And ain't just, been no sex for a year. No. Sound like she fucking somebody else. That's a good reason. Yeah. Yeah, but he didn't say. Sound like she fucking somebody else. It, bro, she yeah. really, it's three years and y'all clear, clearly live together because he jacking off when, yeah. she, when she locked down the legs. So it well, you don't like gotta she, live with it to beat off in her house. She could be fucking somebody else for it. That would it sound like if she done locked yeah. it down. Uh, yeah, because if she was fucking and ain't giving no head, fucking, she fucking. She just ain't fucking with you. You right? She ain't just that. not fucking. Smell a pussy when she come home. No, <laughs> bitch, pull your panties down. <laughs> <laughs> no. Don't hey. do that. Just get up out of there if you finna go out there. Get you get your fanny in your life. Man, okay. <laughs> hey, man. No Sound shit. like you're looking for a fanny and got no panties. Hey, yeah. go get you a fanny, goddamn it. <laughs> Don't be smelling no pussy. Just pull your pussy out. <laughs> man, no. This is smell like leg takes. Bitch, what you been doing? <laughs> Is that sheepskin? <laughs> no, hell no. Oh, no. oh shit! Oh, if she oh, got, if she got condoms in her purse. <laughs> you probably hey, want to get up out of there. Man, okay, right. especially if she ain't fucked in the ear. At least as far as you know. Hey, you but, fucking raw. But yeah, you right though. It's it's a reason. If it ain't a reason, she stopped fucking you. She just started fucking somebody else. Goddamn. No, I'm, I'm sorry. I was supposed to be giving it Man, wait. <laughs> hey, sometimes. Nah, look, for real, though. I feel you. Ain't nobody like trying to learn no new bitch. Because <laughs> fuck that shit. You ain't got to learn a new are, bitch. You got a bitch. Now you're going to have to learn somebody but new. But you because... are going to have to learn a new bitch. Yeah. Enough to get the pussy. Now, what you need to do in order to get the pussy, you just need to learn that what might you got be, to get the pussy. that's where the problem is that, we're, that we have to identify. I'm helping, like, we can help this person. I guess we can. It seems to him like the problem is she ain't giving up the box of the top. She ain't giving up no pussy. Right. Mm. It seems to him like the problem is. Wait a minute. There's not. I feel like we could stop right here. Because we give him the best advice to ever be given. Yeah, he should just leave if a bitch ain't sucking your dick. That's what I'm saying. It's out of there. I was just going to call him. He's trying to go along with her premise, right? So let's help him in what he wants help in. You I, should just leave, though. I you think, I think <laughs> you, you, got, you got to accept, I just got to start over in something new. Because you ain't yeah. get what you want, clearly. It's only been three. I mean, three years is a long time, but it, it, it ain't for real. And if shit was good for the first two years, you might be willing to sacrifice a year of shit not being great. To And on top of that, within this year, she giving you extra pussy? Yeah, wait. I do well, got a not, question, though. Uh, no this shit might last for a year. <laughs> I, I got a question, Kato. Do it say how long he been without? Because if it's been a week, he tripped. A year. A year. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, hell no. Nah. They've been together yeah. three years. Shit, years. four months? No, nah, I'm out of there. I ain't getting no, <laughs> <laughs> <I> ain't getting <laughs> no slop or no uh, box shit. It's over with. <laughs> four months a long time. Man, and you ain't jacking nope. me off? Oh, hell no. Nah. I got to like, do this myself? <laughs> Yeah, With these hands, <laughs> <laughs> all right. out of there. She pew gone, goddamn. No, but look, all right. With. If you do want to stay with the in mm -hmm. the scenario nah, don't stay. that you're in, because we've told you, we've all told you not to. But if you decide, you because it sounds like you want to. It's he, he ain't going nowhere. It sounds he ain't like going you want nowhere. to be there. So if that's the case, 
here's where the real problem is. Mm, the he, real problem is that you have to find out how to obtain pussy a different way than you're used to. That's what you pussy. got to do. You got to get some game. You got to get hit. <laughs> <laughs> but the question is, why is she allowing this? So I think she getting all the benefits that she don't want it to fall. So she's enabling him. She might feel guilty. I feel that, like that's what I'm saying though. But why not just get out of it? Because that sounds like it's going to be toxic as fuck. It, it might, sound like she, she don't want Polly. Uh, you know any of that type of thing. Cause she just—it's probably convenient for I'm them. Just they saying, if, you, if you was a woman and you found out your dude has some bussy, then you might not want to fuck him for a while. Some bussy. And then you'll just tell him like after six, seven, eight months, you'd be like, you know what? You can find some <laughs> pussy somewhere else. Or or if it's been a year. She must really got that gorilla grip because if he, it's been a year, yeah, I ain't left. got none. Yeah, yeah, she might yeah. Be, that might be Fanny. <laughs> it <laughs> might be. you right. He said he, she right. told him six months ago. Yeah. Uh, he been thinking about this shit for six months. That's so a long six time months to be into no off, pussy. She was like, time, hey, bro. you can get some more somewhere else. Man, okay. <laughs> I'm just not moving now. Yeah, fuck that. Move on, bro. Don't <laughs> Y'all eat, roommates. You, you ain't finna salvage. Room, move out and get another yeah, room. Move yeah. it to the other room, guys. Move the new pussy in the other room. Oh, yeah, bring the bitches over there. Hell, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't move ahead. Yeah, don't put regular color lights in there either. Red and blue. Yeah. All this shit. <laughs> the police are here, bitch. <laughs> Green in the bathroom. It's just going cause. down yeah. here, bitch. Yeah. That ain't Every time you open the door, have a loud siren on, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Buy a hookah. Man, okay. Smoke in the shop. You can. I'm in the smoke machine right by the door. <laughs> Bitch is going down the hill. Uh, they gonna be calling some police. Move in. Put it's a definitely note. gonna be red and blue now. Put a sign on the door. Say no wives allowed. <laughs> <laughs> no wives club. <laughs> Hi. Bitch, you want me to you get should. some pussy, bitch? That's what you should do. Man, Start okay. at the old wives club. That sounds so fun. Man, okay. That room sounds fun. That man, you, that bitch gonna bust that door in the room with every like night. smoke machines. <laughs> <laughs> what else is in there? That is a pinball machine. <laughs> Yay. Bingo. Man, okay. <laughs> Why wrong bingo? Dark <laughs> no, not bingo. Why wrong bingo? <laughs> Man, I don't want to play bingo. <laughs> it's all right. You got to spell out bitch instead of bingo. Bitch. 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 I got bitch. I got bitch. <laughs> I got bitch on two cards. <laughs> <laughs> bitch was a name on. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Hey, the best advice you gonna get? Uh, no wives club. <laughs> no wives. I'm feeling that shit. A pinball machine. Hey, oh yeah. yeah. You get a dart boy. You need a dart boy. You know, don't nobody play darts. Man, what? That bitch gonna be dusty. <laughs> Ain't nobody dusting in the no wives Axe. club either. <laughs> Axe throwing. Hey, the man. Axe throwing. Hatchet. Room. They gonna be. We we'll do hatchet throwing. Big as hell. <laughs> Just take that other way. Right, how you walking down the hall of your apartment, open the door and be like, <laughs> <laughs> take that other wall out. Take that other wall out. Not Somebody live above you? Man, Pay what? a ceiling off of there. We, <laughs> we need to vault I these got, ceilings. It's in the corner room. It's it's in the corner. It's in the corner. The room's in the corner. <laughs> Let's vault these ceilings. Somebody order some pillars. Pool over there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Where the property line go to? <laughs> Where the property line? Oh, shit. <laughs> no wives club. I'm telling you. No wives club. I think that's it, man. She gonna take that shit back. I think you'll find yourself in the no wives club. Absolutely. If not, you will find a bitch. <laughs> yeah. You definitely gonna you learn. invited her there. That's how it's talking. Okay. She is now already. Your wife in the next room. Don't worry about that. We don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> Turn on the red and blue lights, bitch. <laughs> the No Wives Club. Man, okay. He got what? He got a bullhorn. Man, what? <laughs> <laughs> this is the No Wives Club. No Wives are allowed in here, just in case anybody in the building needed to know. Man, what? <laughs> Take off your shirts. <laughs> It's going down to here. <laughs> ooch, 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 ooch. <laughs> Phone party! 
<laughs> somebody with a pizza. Man, okay. Somebody with 17 pepperoni pizzas. No watch club. <laughs> I'm still. It's in her door. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, Fool. Absolutely. Fool. No wives club. <laughs> Best advice you're going to get. Anywhere. Ever. Ever. From anybody. Man, all right. Two times up. <laughs> No, tell them we gave you. I want to. Bitch, when you get this shit up and running, call us. We hey, coming. Man, you got to stream live from the No Wives Club. Not before you get the pinball machine, bitch. Yeah, you got to have the pinball man, and okay. the smoke machine. It better not be No Wives Club with no smoke man, machine. I <laughs> oh, oh, man. Already, God damn it. Holy. I oh, think this is for us. I Saint think we done. Gems. I think so. I think, I think, think so. Finished. Um, I uh, hope. I hope y'all appreciate the advice we brought to y'all. Yeah. I hope you can use it and you pass it along to everybody else who can use it. Um, it's been another Reddit on Reddit. If give you permission to go get some more pussy, no wives club next door. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Woo, woo, oh, God. And we play a sale at 3 o'clock in the morning, bitch. <laughs> Routine, routine drive-by. Okay, no. <laughs> Every morning. Damn. I want to uh, be over here no more. <laughs> it's okay. There's a bolt lock on the door. <laughs> this is the No Wives Club. How the motherfucker about me going to bring drive-bys? <laughs> uh -oh. I tried to be smart and shit. You motherfuckers uh -oh. pushed me over the edge. Air this bitch out. I fell play. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. Oh. All right, guys. I ain't in mind. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for spending time with us. Thanks for uh, letting us into your homes, cars, uh, jobs. Earpods, the headphones, shit, too. All that shit. I ain't in mind. All of those things. Uh, don't forget, because it's really important. Take your pockets out to slacks when you iron. Out your jeans, too. You don't want that little weird you on your thigh. Are oh, you fucked me up with it? I thought you were finna say something really important. <laughs> <laughs> That's very important. Hey, and if you don't, if you don't want to do that, just get you a steamer. A good one, though. Because the $15 ones can only iron eight curtains before they die. <laughs> hey, the thirty dollar would be going though. Hey, that yeah, bitch been going strong. Be get you, get you one more than fifteen dollars. Get, uh, get you one fifteen if you want it for this job. Whatever you got to steam right now. Yeah, that's true. If, if you, you in you the need pitch, a temporary God, one, man, you, right. it's like the U pass of steamers. Right. You could, before you clean out. Eight hours though. <laughs> eight hours, bitch. You out of here. Um, what else? Uh, don't forget, cinnamon's not sweet. Um, Android is not a type of phone. Okay, just make sure you was okay. No, over I ain't got there. Say. I'll make sure you was okay over there. All right, I'm good. Uh, I'm good. <laughs> she right around. The type of phone. If she if she if she know all the lyrics to Every Rocco, time they swing my dough. I count six, ten, five. If she know all the lyrics to Gucci Mane, Burr. If she know, if she says Jeezy's ad libs when the song yeah, first starts, boy. <laughs> it's because all she did was ride around listening to dope boy music Chill. with dope boys. So do with that what you must. Um, and don't forget, Kings. All she really wants is to eat some chicken wings and take a nap on your couch. The runway's clear after that. All right, the runway clear. I don't even. What you got for? Okay? I don't even want to tell them, man. <laughs> um. Don't talk to him. No wives club coming soon. <laughs> coming soon. <laughs> not in my <laughs> Absolutely not. All we need is different color bowls. She gonna air this bitch out. <laughs> <laughs> One time she, she forget it in the purse. She gonna air this bitch out. <laughs> I said my purse. My purse is here now. Okay. <laughs> um. <clears throat> take care of your credit and shit. I was about to say kids. <laughs> Take care of your kids and shit too. Do that too. Good advice. This is some great advice. Um, Take care of your credit and your kids. <laughs> I, ain't, I can't give you no better advice than that. And get you some cash. Yeah. Take care of your credit and your kids and get you some cash. 
Excuse your me. Your credits she... and your kids. Do right. them both. All three of them. Get you some cash, too. Get you some cash. Don't just focus on your credit. Get you some money, too, God damn it. You got to tell people when you tell them to get money to find a safe place to store it so it doesn't. Yeah, put the put the shit in the bank. Maybe. Because I don't even then know you how don't safe have the cash anymore. Is. But not cash. It's, it's much like physical cash. Oh, get that's what some, it sounds some like. Get you some money on cash. hand as well. so old. Yeah, get you some money you can spend. Get you some, <laughs> I want to say currency. I get guess I am old. Go get God a bag. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I guess so. The bags be expensive, though. Get some notes. Hey, <laughs> get some money you can do something with and get you some credit. Get both for the help. With your broke ass. Man, I know. <laughs> we working on changing that. We got to change that. Shit. We trying to get out of there. <laughs> what else you got for? No wives club ain't going to no be wives cheap, club. God damn it. It ain't not with them lights and the smoke. Man, we need, you know we need air purifiers and shit. All this shit. shit. You can't just be breathing in smoke machine <laughs> fumes. God damn it. Everybody in the wild club got canceled. It's fucked up. Um, that's all I got for him. Mike, what you got for him? Um, don't leave lighters and shotgun shells around your children. Don't do that shit. <laughs> Don't do that shit. Put them Take where they can get. Take care of your house. Your house might end up being burnt down. Um, and and if you and if you find you a Fanny, Fanny May, or even Fanny Willis, Willis got that gorilla grip. You know, uh, just just enjoy the ride. Enjoy the ride. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey. Oh, Smoke some bitch. Smoke some bitch. Smoke some bitch. Smoke some bitch. Call 256 788 7339. Call us, goddamn. Ask the smokers at gmail.com. I took your lines, goddamn. No, it's fine. I was doing the call to your song. Oh, shit. That's what I'm saying. (laughs) I'm I'm glad you found some rhythm in that bitch. Yeah. Shit, we can dance together to that bitch. No, we can't. No, we can't. can't. No, we're not right. dancing. You're Don't right. say we can dance together. <laughs> no. That's the sequence. That's the sequence dancing. I, not I, not I understood what I said. I ain't understood. Because we could have done it if you hadn't said it. Yeah, no, you're right. It, you're right. Like, right. No, after I heard it, can't. I said it and I heard it while I was saying it. Like, what the fuck this nigga say? Oh, you didn't. Yeah. It was in your voice that said what the fuck this nigga say? said. That. Yeah, it was the same voice. All right. Who, it would, who else would it be? <laughs> Just ask. One day, one day for like three hours, my my voice in my head had an Irish accent. No. I mean, sometimes it just don't always be the same voice. That's kind of my problem. Yeah, man. <laughs> What's up, guys? Okay. <laughs> it's all like an I hear it. <laughs> yeah, what, what other accents? Can we, I can understand that one pretty well. Man, all that right. works. That's that works. <coughs> yeah, two five six seven eight eight seven three two nine at smokers at gmail dot com. Thank y'all, man. One twenty in the books. White Mike, off white Mike. Fucking fuck, man, off I white Mike. It. Yes, sir. The Reverend Bob. We out this bitch. Peace. Smoke yes, some sir. bitch. You want some free shit? Call two five six seven eight eight seven three three nine. Turn on the red and blue lights, bitch. <laughs>